All right, welcome in, guys. I'm super unready today. I mean, this was the basically the second time that I delayed the stream today only. And yeah, I don't know. Just one day is not enough time to like prepare properly for a good stream. So yeah, I just I tried to squeeze in this anyway because like I have free today, I have off today and I thought yeah, when else can I do it? So I I need to make the most out of this day. So I thought, yeah, I squeeze in the stream today, we do some grinding and whatever. Just chat and chill. But yeah, it's just not enough time. You need more time to... I need more time to like uh, set stuff up and like think up what I want to do and... I don't know, the, the whole presentation and the... Uh, yeah, everything. And there's also stuff for work that I had to deal with that also got into the way. Um, yeah, anyway, whatever. But now I'm here. And I'm on Team Nessie. I want to show you that because that's kind of the theme of the day or the theme of the week, if you will. And yeah, I want to I wanna have Nessie to be real, so that's why I picked that team, basically. Because I already know that aliens technically are undeniably real, so there's no way to really argue that aliens don't really exist. And Bigfoot, I don't really know much about Bigfoot, to be honest. In my life, I didn't hear any rumors or stuff about Bigfoot too much. I know that it's a thing, I guess, and even seeing it here is like proof that it's a thing. But I'm mostly into Nessie, like when it comes to the mythical aspect of the whole stuff. So yeah, also yeah, Nessie is just a nice, nice idea, nice, nice story. And yeah, look at this cute picture here. You, you kind of want to support that, right? So, but yeah, either way, the point of today's stream is basically for me to just grind some stuff. Because I want to adjust my, my gear set just one more time. I thought up some changes and I want to try to get them done. Also here, this is the scanned new banner that you can get. I'm not sure where it's from. I think it's from the some championship in America or something. And they they held that championship in a certain place and I think that's like the logo of that place or something. I'm not too sure but yeah, it's a nice banner, banner. Let me see how that looks. Yeah, also, I almost finished the catalog by now, so I also have that. So the, the, the swordfish banner, that's also pretty nice looking. We might even use that though. Or should we? Or should we go with the new one? It's kind of more exquisite, but I guess everyone has it. Everyone who is on Twitter, they already have that banner, so it's not that special. Um, yeah, we could could wrap this for a bit, just to see how it, how it looks. But I hate that you can't really read the, the text above, so... That's what I... I don't really understand about banners. Like, there are banners that you can hardly even see the text, like this. White text on, like, what is that color even? Like, light greenish, light blue, like green, like whatever. You can hardly see the text, and I hate that. Isn't the point of your banner to make the text the most visible? And here on this one, yellow and white like ah, really it's not i can't really read that too well 
and same for the hammer uh, hammerhead <laughs> yeah a swordfish you know it's a white background white white and light blue background kinda and white and white uh text i don't know it's just it doesn't really satisfy me when i look at at it so stuff like this, for example, here, this is what I can look at and I think like, okay, it's black background, white, white uh, text, that's all fine, it's the most contrast you can get. Or stuff like that, like really dark background and really bright text, that's all fine to me. But yeah, what am I, what I, <laughs> what am I even complaining about? Also, it seems I got new stuff here. Ah, it's from the catalog, the swaggy musician, yeah. I remember. Didn't check that off my list here. There we go, the musician. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna go back to the stuff I had. Mo movie loving actor. It's kind of, I don't know, like, I'm just locked into the John Squid name right now. I can't change it for a month, so I gotta make the best out of it. Because as you know, in the 400 sub special that we did lately, I had to change my name to John Squid to fit the whole theme. But now I'm, yeah, locked into that name. Okay, let's get the cash of the day thing. Okay, that was nothing. So yeah, the deal is... Um, I can show you. The deal is, I wanna change the foot gear, the shoes, the main, the main effect of the shoes. I wanna go away and be ink recovery which i have three subs off right now but i want to make the three subs into one main on my shoes and therefore i have three more sub slots uh like open and in those slots i want to fill in the the swapped out main which is the the special power up which means I need three slots filled up with main power up, uh, with with special power up, and I want all the three slots on the shirt, which already has that effect on the main slot. So I want to fill up the whole shirt with all all special power up gear effects. Like I I want everything to be special power up and that's obviously not so easy because I need to scrub the shoes and the the shirt because now we need to have the bomb defense or sub defense on the shoes instead instead of the shirt just for it's just for the looks guys so don't get me wrong this is all just aesthetics I want it to to look clean in the end when I'm done with it and I want the ink resistance sub slot to be on the very left and then have the two other slots being the, the sub defense. So I basically have to reroll that anyway. Or at least change two, two effects around somehow. So that, that costs me at least like 30 chunks or so, I guess. But yeah. But you can see I already, I had great expenses to even get to what I have right now for the, for the special power up effect. Because I, I had to force in the two main slots just by chunks. <laughs> and that's like 90 chunks just for those two effects. And yeah, I can't do that again. I, I, I need some other chunk for other gear and not only just this gear set for my pencil so yeah I wanna try and roll them without without chunks so basically we could pop some tickets right here 
which I guess I can do but the other thing there's another catch to this you can see my rank is horrible my rank is like oh my god um <laughs> I somehow crawled out of the four digits on the negative points but I'm still on s minus 500 something so five six hundred basically and I want to somehow crawl out of s hell obviously if I can which is not as easy when I reroll my my gear if I get rid of the effects on my gear on two on the yeah on two parts on the on the shirt and on the shoes and we have zero effects on those and I can uh, it's really 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 rough to play the pencil without ink recovery I tell you that's basically for the main weapon the most useful effect from what I think the ink recovery and yeah whatever okay I guess we can just start I guess I'll just do it also yeah yeah wait 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 there's one more thing the the daily shop items I want to check them because I didn't yet so let's see I figured I need more uh what is it here yeah, Takaroka I need more Takaroka brands because I wanna get the the batch for the Takaroka Takaroka brand batch. Let's see. Yeah, I need to. Ah, but I don't want to waste. Ah, oh, it's so rough. It's so much. There, there's so much playing into this whole thing. I can't waste money because I now need the money to re-roll my, my, my shirt and my shoes. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. Let's just reroll, guys, and then see what we get. And by reroll, I mean just scrub the slots, obviously. And then we level up again by fighting. <clears throat> oh, yeah, there's also Splatfest here. Actually. Actually, we might. We might just use the Splatfest T even. We might just put that on. Is that a good idea? If we put this on and level it up, while also leveling up the, the shoes, then we have different XP on it, right? I have 1.8 million yeah I guess you never buy stuff in the shops because as you can see my gear has five stars here on it and this as well has five stars and this has five stars and this has five stars and this has like three stars stuff like that I'm buying a lot of those star upgrades on my gear and that's that costs insane amounts of money in the shops and therefore I'm always bankrupt I never have any money with me here in Splatoon I'm chronically broke and yeah that's a huge deal uh, I think we will not level a Splatfest T this time I think we'll just stick to the plan and I'm gonna scrub the slots yeah let's just do what we planned so I'm scrubbing slots on the shirt ah that hurts me <sighs> it has to be I think because the thing is ah no nah, I can't explain even I want to keep it modular, you know, 
And two mains is like the bare minimum that I can accept. And one main and three subs is almost the same. Yeah, whatever. Let's do it. Let's do it. And as you can see, scrubbing slots also takes a lot of money. I just wasted 40k on this action here. So it's really hard to contain any money in this game. When you go for the... Yeah, for the grindy stuff. So, but we now want to use that ticket to make... To make our chances slightly better to, to roll this thing. We need three of this in a row on our shirt. If we get three on the shoes though, I might keep it too. I might I might let it slip. And the other stuff I cannot change. So the the headgear is pretty much perfect. I can't do anything about that. But yeah. Let's try to win with this not so great gear set now. It's kinda hard to do because I suck at aiming in the first place, which already like cuts my abilities in half basically that I could achieve with my with the pencil set. Uh yeah. And I try to make up for my lack of aim by painting better and like positioning stuff and other plays. But yeah, now we also lack the ink recovery. I don't know how that's gonna go. <laughs> Alright. So what do we have? Shooter guys and a Nautilus. Also my my controller isn't in greatest shape. Oh what the hell? My controller isn't in greatest shape because it's uh it, it was used to be broken even, but it somehow worked again at some point, so I started using it again. But I feel like it's, it's starting to break again. Ah, that was unfortunate. Oh, I need my own tactic cooler. Okay, damn it. I should have went for Kula first and then grabbed the Raymaker. That was a mistake. I'm not warmed up. <laughs> Lol. Also, we have zero ink resistance at this point, which is horrible. You want at least one ink resistance in your gear set. It's so crucial. Oh, I'm dead. No, maybe not. Yeah, let's see how this goes. Now we are set up with the Raymaker. Oh my god. Okay, close. Yeah, that should do it. Okay, there we go. Okay, almost good. Yeah, I still haven't changed the, the main slot of the shoes, so we now still have the two mains of Kula, Kula Boost.
I think I will only swap it once we get the other stuff. Because I think cooler effect is one of the best things in the kit. Okay, that sucks. That sucks. Oh man, okay, what do we do for roll a wrong ability? I think we just have to keep keep leveling until we have all the slots filled up and then re-roll them. I think I I don't know if you even can re-roll them or just scrub them when there's only one effect on it. I never try it. Because it's inefficient. But I'm just thinking. But yeah, at least we get chunks. So... It's something. Good. Also, yeah, guys, how's your day? How's your start of the week, I guess? Because it's, it should be Monday today, if I'm not mistaken. At least in my time zone. Oh man, my aim. Why am I killing myself? Why? Oh my god, that was so stupid. Yeah, popping Raymaker shield is a big issue with this weapon. You can't really do that. What? It even works on higher ground? What? Did I know that? I don't know. Yeah, guys, basically my plan for today was to get that... that pure. And while we do that, we also get conch shells for the Nessie. Team Nessie. Ah, get me the drink! Well, what am I doing? I didn't know what to do when the blaster came up. The clash. Okay. I wish I had aim, I swear. I, was, I would be so much better if I would hit the shots. Okay, almost. I think I hit him. Nah, I didn't. Nah, that was not my hit. But yeah, my plan for today was to have a huge grind going until I get what I want, which is the pure. And meanwhile we get some levels and chunks and conch shells and whatever. And then like, spent them all on the... on the... shell out machine. And maybe get, get even some more stuff there. And also get, get a lot of points for Team Nessie. And I have my pure ready for when the Splatfest comes around. Which actually doesn't even work. I just, <laughs> I just realized, wait a second. Yo, what's up? Welcome in, Hide. You were waiting like forever. I, I kept you waiting for hours today. I'm sorry. I just... I wasn't ready at all. I couldn't make it happen. I'm sorry. I, I explained that earlier in the stream. I just couldn't prepare the stuff in time for... For the starting time to be earlier. It's just not... It wasn't possible due to work and whatever stuff I had to deal with. There was a lot of, like, side... side-tracking. 
but yeah, I guess better late than never, so here we are. And we will see. On, like, I have one basically good news that uh, involved the delay, which is due to the, the stuff that I had to deal with before the stream. I figured out I can, like, I have to work later tomorrow, later than usual. Which means I could technically stream slightly longer than I planned, but I don't know about that. Like, I think I will just go until I don't want anymore. <clears throat> because, yeah, grinding chunks and stuff is not that fun. But, yeah, we will see. At least we have a bit more time in like the in the end. You're all good, bro. I've been a little busy too. <laughs> busy with Platoon, I guess. <clears throat> yeah, it's fine. At least we all reunite here now. Okay. So we need to get those slots filled up and then we have to reroll them. This is why I didn't spend the money that I have here um, in the shops yet. I usually just go t to the daily items in the shops and then see what I need and then buy, buy what I can. And then I'm out of money obviously, out of cash, out of squid cash. But we need the money for the rerolls now, which is why I kept it. But it's still not being enough. I, I know already that by the time you fill up one one shirt or shoes or whatever, the three slots on one item, I know that by that time you do not get enough money to get a new reroll going. So I guess we can only reroll once again after this. And then we have to grind money first in order to get re-rolls even. Ah, oh, it's so rough. Grinding chunks and stuff is so... can get really grindy. At least if you do it the way I do. Maybe there's a better way. But I don't think so. Like how... the way how I want to do it is only possible in that kind of way. It's my birthday, but I'll probably play later, lol. Okay, yeah, busy, busy with having birthday, yeah, I get it. Then, yeah, uh, how do you say? Happy birthday, I guess. I was thinking, like, what? what's even the, the saying that you say on, on birthdays? I was, like, confused for a second. How is my team so horrible? How are they so overwhelmed by this? Are you joking? And guess what? We lost the rank. Oh god. Guys, you saw this. This was not my fault. This was like, I don't know what my team even did. I tried to get the middle. Like, you see the... Uh, the other checkpoint I tried to get that and press into the map from the left side but I don't know what my team did on the right side they were three guys on that side actually we didn't lose points that's good because we spent I think 170 to get here now we get 220 so basically we got more points out of this than we lost so that's a good thing, because then we can get out of this freaking S hell, as I told you. I want to get out of here, man. I need to enter X rank because it's like just way better, way more fun. Thanks. Okay, I guess my stream is horribly delayed, so I'm sorry for that. I enabled the, the rewind functionality, which always adds a lot of lag to my stream or delay, if you will like latency for the stream but I figured yeah since we have a delay anyway I can just add some more delay 
just for the people maybe they come in and they see some something that they like and they want to rewatch it or something or they check in late and they want to catch up on what I just said before this and yeah and then they can go back in time and like rewind my stream and watch that moment from for themselves and then like skip to the live section again and then see what's what's going on there I think it's a neat feature. I sometimes use it myself when I watch other streams here on YouTube, so that's why I kept it on. Because I think it's pretty it's pretty handy sometimes. X Wing is honestly worse. This season it's not like unplayable, but it can be pretty bad. Yeah, I know X Rank. Like I I usually be in X Rank, but I just I dropped out obviously because of the season season change um, but I couldn't get back up to X rank here in this season yet because I was I forced myself to stick with the pencil all the way so I did not use any other weapon than the pencil yet and it's freaking hard to get consistent wins and stuff with this weapon when you're not even good with it and I, I don't even have a gear set or nah yeah now I have a gear set but I didn't use to have a gear set so it was freaking hard to rank up with this weapon here ah oh, you can't pop rainmaker yeah it's really horrible pencil is is a pain but it's a fun pain I kinda like it honestly Otherwise, I wouldn't play this anymore, but I'm just in love with this pencil. So much fun. It just feels so good to to have it, I don't know. I feel like John Squid, honestly. Like, it, it makes me feel like, like a badass guy or something. And that feeling alone is worth for me to keep playing this weapon. It doesn't even matter if the gameplay sucks or every, everything. It's just such a great design. I, I will also make a video about this pencil, but who knows when. It's it's taking way too much time. But I will try to make a pencil video at some point, and then I can explain some some of the genius of this weapon. It's it's so beautiful. I just love it. And therefore I want to honor this insane design. I want to honor this, this great design of a weapon and therefore I try to keep playing it and not swap weapons to something else. I want to really get the best out of this thing. And maybe eventually grow some lag, e uh, some, some aim even. Maybe I can grow some aim and then I can... Pop it, pop it, pop it. Oh my god. And also, I don't think even it's a bad weapon, but I will explain all this in the video, so look forward to that video at some point, but it will take weeks from here, so don't expect this to be tomorrow or something. It will take weeks, let, let alone months maybe. Might even take me months, like some other videos did. It's just, at this point, it's just due to my lack of time, because I'm, like, busy and whatever. But that will change in the coming months. But, yeah. If I try to get something out right now, then it will take weeks and months. But I, I have to make this pencil video, as I said, I'm too much in love for this weapon, it's, it's too great. I cannot not make this video, it's, it's impossible. I need to sh give this weapon something back, it's too good. Oh my god, nah, I couldn't make it up the ramp, I had it. 
think I had it. If I made it up the ramp, I think I could have dunked it. Oh, let's cut him off. Okay, nice one. Also, it is so satisfying. The For some reason, I love the... When the shots... When the shots hit something, like this little... I don't know, it feels like pencil lead. It's just... The, the sound detection of the hits... It's it's really unlike a regular sniper. The other the other charger weapons, they feel like some crazy headshot satisfaction. I don't know, but the pencil is a weird, weirdly different satisfaction. I can't even explain. This is you gotta play this for yourself. It's really weird, but it's really good. Platoon sound design is really good. Yeah, sound design in general. This game is insane. I have no idea how they make it so good. It's on everything. Even uh, I would even say the the HD rumble design is as also is pretty crazy. The whole sound and rumble and color and everything like design wise this game is crazy I got 13 kills what that's like my record I think what the hell I think that's actually my record 13 <clears throat> like the SFX for Stringer directs it's so satisfying. Yeah, I didn't play too much too much Stringer yet, but I believe you. And they even had way new designs. Like when I see the Hydra here, the Hydra has different sounds than in Splatoon 2 and all that stuff. They added even like extra stuff in Splatoon 3 that wasn't present in the second game they like polished everything to to crazy yeah it's just a beautiful game altogether So yeah, speaking of the stringer, we got one in our team. I actually hit that guy, can you believe? Oh my god, how did I... How did I get killed by that guy? How did I not make it out? I was like waiting for the sloshes and I tried to jump out, but yeah. I guess that was lag. Hello? You saw me hit him twice. I sh ah, no, 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 I shouldn't rush it. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine to die even because I'm on cooler effect. We can afford to get killed here. Oh, really? Really? Oh, this is what I hate about my aim. It's so horrible that I can... The, even the simplest kills I somehow miss. <clears throat> ah, body blocked. Okay, there we go. 
Don't, don't, don't. Oh my god, whatever. It's fine. No, it's not fine. Oh my god. Why would you get killed? Oh my god. I hate teams like that. Can't they not just like throw toxic mist or something? <sighs> I had two guys down and one was distracted basically by the Raymaker shield when I jumped off the, the map. So how can they not? When they are free guys, how can they not win a free V2 when one is even distracted? How? I just don't understand. This makes no sense. And why can they not just throw a bomb or something to, to slow down the Raymaker? It's another mystery that I can never understand. <clears throat> yeah guys I have a question for you here if you okay <laughs> never mind though never mind so the question now let me get into the match first so the question is the pencil this is what I'm trying to figure out. If you look at the pencil, you see those three lead pieces inside of the barrel. And you also see the one lead piece at the tip. So basically we, we visually see four shots of the weapon loaded into the barrel. The first question is where is the fourth shot? Is it in between the three and the, the fourth uh, lead piece? Or is it in the back somewhere? And then the second question that ties into that is how does the weapon shoot out the lead? How is it designed to, to propel the ink out of the weapon? How is it? How is how's the mechanical thing working? Okay, I did die on purpose here though. This was all on purpose. I wanted to like delay them a bit by dying in the Raymaker. Please! Ah, oh, no way. I hit- Oh my god. Throw your bomb, throw your torpedo, throw your fucking bomb. Ah, oh, man. It's so easy to lose your mind on this game. It's, it's really, it's really easy. Oh, please. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't even mind it. Like, I usually don't care for my rank, but I want to get to freaking X rank. That's all I want to. And then I don't care in X rank. I can... I can be whatever, like... Minus something. I can be X power a thousand or so. I don't care. I just want to play against X rank people. That's all I want. And this S players here, oh my lord. Sometimes, like, I'm not even talking about those guys here. I'm just talking sometimes. They are ridiculous. They actually try to lose. And I cannot understand that. And I want to get out of S for sure. Like, get me... F Get me into freaking X where I belong. And then I can... Yeah, it's it's all fine. It's, it's at least... I don't know. I don't even know if it's better, honestly. Might not. Ok. 
Okay, can someone paint maybe? That's another kind of issue. The pencil can paint in some way. But not quick enough, that's the issue. You can paint well in the... Like the surface it paints is pretty good. But not the speed. <coughs> also, I might need to take a break at some point, just saying. Because I... I only ate like half of the bowl of oats that I had ready. And I might eat the other half at some point. Oh, I don't get freaking killed here. And why would I hide inside my own sprinkler? That's like the worst hiding spot ever. Yeah, I wasn't sure if I should jump out or something, like, I was hesitant. Guys, can someone do something? Okay, let me handle this. I've had enough of that. Oh no. There was someone left, nobody cares. Tony Cancer doesn't care, what the hell? Okay, that was unlucky. Ah, oh, can we... Can we get the scumbag? Looks really bad, honestly. Ah, uh, we might lost, because of that guy. It's usually when I grab Raymaker, it's I'm like somewhat safe. Nah, it's not gonna do it. Actually, if he dunks it. If he can somehow dunk it. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can re grab it and then I can take it. Okay, give this to me. Give this to me. Okay, okay, we have a shot. Oh my god, oh my god. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh, is this enough time? Yes, it is. Holy crap. Okay, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure where the 23 points are. I thought it was like very close to the to the pedestrian thing. I wasn't sure if I could push in at this point, so I, I was kind of waiting. Ah, oh, that was clutch. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. <coughs> Yeah, even though the team was horrible, they they kind of kept it together at least. I appreciate that. Twenty-one kills on the Tetra. Wow. It never felt like that, honestly. Always when I see kill counts like that, I'm, I'm like, okay, where, <laughs> where, where did they? I didn't see them in the match, like the kills were not visible to me or not, I didn't realize them inside of the match. But yeah. Okay, good stuff. So let's see, we need three more wins. If we get that, I think we get like 300 points maybe. And then we should be at minus 200, and then we pay another 170. And then we might get into the positives after that. If we get another actual win streak without losers. Because I think the losers, they they cut like 100 points or so off of your, off your score or something. I never really figured this out, but... It's not too important. Oh my god. That was actually good, but I didn't realize. 
I baited him to swing at me for the first swing of the roller. And then the second swing I... I sacrificed myself. Oh come on, I did jump out, what the hell. Oh, that was, okay, that was a nice trade actually. That was like a winning trade if you will. Okay, let's get out of here. We need to defend. No we don't. Oh yes we do. I don't even... I didn't even get my drink in the cooler. <laughs> Lol, I totally forgot to swim by. Sometimes I actually set up the cooler for my team, but not for myself. Like, on purpose. Sometimes I do want to not get the drink. So that I can die and maybe get it after, or do some other shenanigans and then get my drink very delayed or I guess technically a big brain play would be to to also be invisible um, for the other team like when you wanna hide and you wa don't wanna have the the boost things on showing being shown on you so that you stay invisible, basically. Okay, he didn't recharge his health, that was his mistake. Damn it. <clears throat> Could have been a sneaky push. Insanely lucky, oh my lord. I don't know what that refers to. Yes. No. My shot didn't come out. I did tap shot, but it didn't come out. I could blame my controller though. My controller has issues releasing the shooting button, which is a big deal on my pencil, but sometimes the shot gets stuck, basically. Oh no, oh no. You're getting a lot better with the Snipe Rider. Yeah, it, it kind of feels so right now, but it could be the team, because I had some other matches. Where I thought I was good, but then I still lost, like, horribly. And it's all about, like, see, it's kind of the opponents. They, they trick me into thinking I'm good, but I guess they just throw. Okay, also Rainmaker is a bit not so representative. Because I often pick up the Rainmaker and then just deal with that weapon. Because I just basically switch weapons there and have the Raymaker Cannon be my weapon. So it's a bit flawed here, this showcase, but yeah, you might be right. I'm always learning, trying to get better with the Snipe Rider. And also, I did lower the sensitivity by one point lately. And I think that that made, made a big difference. I even noticed that last time I played. And it does a lot to the, the accuracy of the sniper. I can just point at stuff a bit easier or a bit more steady. And that helps so much. I did actually not really know that I have to do that. Because I never picked up any charger weapon in the first place. So I'm completely unfamiliar with any sort of... Yeah, chargers. 
And also I figured out you have to wait before you shoot. Like I, I used to shoot like this basically. And I try to like get the shot when I slip over the target kind of. But I think you want to like move to the target and like adjust and then like make wait for a couple frames so that you're sure that you will hit the shot and then you release your shot i think that's how you use uh charges in the first place i did not ever understand that before but i think during playing this weapon here i got a better hang of how charges even work and i noticed that by like playing a lot of e-leaders in the other team I always have to dismantle the e-leader in the other team because I have the longest range and whatever and I have to basically do 1v1s against the e-leader player on the other team and then I noticed what they do and I tried to like copy what they do and I always saw that they take their time for the shots they're not even they don't really rush the shot they actually take their time to make sure that they hit because that saves them more time in the end than just rushing and missing and then recharging again that's like more time than just taking your time and I figured that that out and I think that's a that's a pretty good way to play charger weapons but I just haven't get the hang of it yet I don't I'm not used to it yet but I know the idea now, I have the idea now and ha have, have the inspiration how it could be better. I just need to get used to that and try to implement that in my own gameplay. Which takes time, but as you can see it might, it might work out eventually. Uh, I was talking about the flings I encounter at the start. Yeah, I think that was lucky. I was a bit lucky and a bit like... Un unplanned genius but yeah <laughs> sometimes it all comes together and your aim is getting better though yeah the aim is also a bit dependent on the opponents obviously if they are very slippery and good in dodging then it's it's obviously harder but with those guys here it's not that that hard I don't know where to go. They have a big lead. I could maybe watch the Tetra player and how they get their kills. Okay, not like that. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, please. Okay. Yeah, the jet is somewhere. There he is. Oh, please. How? Oh my god. And how did that not hit me? How did I survive the flings out? What the hell? Oh, it's not. It's, yeah, it is a flings out. There is a flings out. Yeah, it was a flings out. What do we do? Okay, we die, but I took two with me, that's fine. Oh, how do we push here? The, the deal is, I cannot really paint, as I told you, it's too slow. I cannot paint and push. I can basically paint, but I can only... Like, there's this different way of painting, you might know this. Like... If you have a sploosh, basically, you can rush in and paint the other side, like the enemy side. There's that kind of, uh, that kind of painting. But there's also this, like, cleaning up painting in your side. That's kind of what I feel I can do with this weapon. But not the active painting. Let's, let's see. Aw oh, man, I hate that you cannot enter walls 
when you stand in enemy ink but the wall is your ink you can't get the momentum to enter the wall that sucks I had that so many times already Okay, the right flank is covered oh my god please god give me aim give me the lead give me the lead no way I messed up so hard I messed up so ridiculously hard this is insane that was so my fault I should have killed the the Hydra and then the move would have worked it would all worked out Okay, come on, I need cooler. Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm dead. Ah no, that was so that was a checkmate kinda. Ah uh, I should have picked Raymaker first, then go to my cooler, and then dodge all the stuff after. Ah damn it. But I screwed up anyway before, that was that was all my fault. That was so sad, yeah, that was sad. Damn it, that was... I hate losing like this, because I know it's my fault and it was so dumb. Ah, okay. Even mode change. I hope it's not splat zones, because... People do not understand plat splat zones. It's so I don't know how it's hard to understand this mode. But splat zones is what I feel people get the le the least. They even understand clam blitz better than splat zones sometimes. And I don't know how. What's so hard about painting a zone and waiting? <laughs> I don't get it, but whatever. It's tower anyway, so I'm fine. But yes, splat zones. Uh, I get this problem of painting quickly. Uh, that that becomes a problem again with this weapon here. That's why I'm kind of worried for splat zones a bit, because I need my team to understand that, and they don't. And yeah, then it becomes really grindy and rough to even get something going there. People don't like play the objective in solo. Yeah, 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 yeah. People, they do, I don't know what they even do. They go for kills and stuff, maybe. Some nonsense like that. But they do not understand what to even, what's the point of the mode even. Like, when you just want to go for kills, why don't you play Turf War then? I don't get it. Isn't that way easier to get, like, normal gameplay going? But, yeah. What am I complaining? Let's see how this tower stuff goes. Because... Here's the same deal that I have with the aiming again. The aiming problem that I have is coming into play here on tower because see I need to get those guys off the tower but you need like crazy aim to hit them like this and I usually I don't have the patience for that aiming for the for that little weight that I told you about I usually have this habit to not have the patience but I need to develop this patience in order to get anything going here. Oh my god. Can I sneak this? Yes, okay, trade was fine, but I missed the other guy. The other guy that I shot before was more important. And I didn't even, like, go after him, which I should. I'm dead. I'm not. Oh, man. Ah, oh, that, that's a rough start. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, honestly, tower is not the greatest mode for this weapon. I feel like, mm, yeah, you can work it out. 
but I cannot. That's like it's a personal thing, I guess. Personal deficit that I suck in this mode with this weapon. Okay, but we got some points anyway. That's good. So we we climbed up in the rank somehow. Okay, 300 deficit, now we pay 170, now we're 400 something, so if we get the streak, we should be at like 150, and then we need like a bad streak or so, but some, some wins, and then maybe next, next streak could get us in the positive. But yeah, meanwhile, you can explain me how the pencil works, because I told you, you see four shots here. You see the tip top, the tippy top lead piece, and you see the three others in the barrel. So where's the four, the, where's the fifth shot? Is it between, is it like behind the tip? Is that where the fourth shot is? Or is it in the, in the shaft where the hand, the handle is? Is that where the last shot is? And then there's also the cartridge that you fill up by charging. You know that this the the cartridge that sticks out of the weapon uh, that loads up with five more lead pieces. And where do they go when the weapon is is loaded with those? Like, yeah. does someone has any explanation for how the, the mechanical part of the weapon works? I'm trying to figure this out for my video because I'm a bit intrigued of if this is even a... if they thought this through and it's an actual thought out design or if it is just gaming logic and like, yeah, it just works, whatever. And they don't care, like, it's not, it's not uh, accurate in the sense of the mechanical part. I'm puzzled of that question, I, I want to figure that out. It just interests me for, for the overall understanding of the weapon. Oh my lord. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna jump out, whatever. That's the nice part, you can just retreat and like go to defense mode. With the cooler effect. Because you have all the, the boosts you can get. Nice. Oh my god. How do they know? I'm so stunned by the e-leader player sometimes. They just know stuff. They have like a different understanding of the game, it feels. They play the game way different than me. And it also works, and that's pretty interesting, pretty inspiring to me. Oh my god. Yeah, that was no way out. Maybe squid rolling on the tower? That could have worked, maybe. Ah, we got doom squid cleaning up on the back. That was good. Oh my god, I cannot hit anything. Okay, where's doom squid? In the back again. They got this. Oh my god, okay. Yeah, not bad. Oh god. Please, nah, man. Cooler takes so long to come out. I hate the specials delay. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh, 
Oh, I imagine I had that shot. Oh, the cooler defense. See, this is what I mean. I'm jumping all over the place, but I'm not hitting my shots because I don't have this patience. I need to develop this this waiting, and then stuff should maybe work out. I hope. I think that's how snipers work, but I just don't have this in my brain. Need to work on that. But it's really, it's like the learning, you know? Whenever you learn something completely new, your brain struggles to, to get it going. It takes so long to, like, slap it into your synapses. Ah, oh, my aim! He was dead, I think. Or maybe not. Okay, where's Doom Squid? Right here. Okay, let's just defend this and win the game, whatever. Okay. <laughs> not even needed. But yeah, that is just what I noticed here in this match. I'm rushing in. And I'm going for the, the my usually play play style with other weapons. And I do this with this weapon. It in theory it could work, I guess, but it does not in practice here. So far at least. Maybe when I have God aiming and I can actually pull that off and even hit my shots in that hasty way. Then it might work out, but I'm not I'm not at that point at all. Also, okay, we got one. We actually got one um one special power up. But we need three and we need three on the shirt. But yeah, that was only 10 matches on the ticket, so we have half the ticket left. Which means we might have just the same odds again. So let's try again. Let's waste another 40k on this. So let me see about those trucks here. We have like a weird remix of the Splatfest theme already. It's so crazy how they have different versions of the plaza. just for the Splatfest event. They have like three or even four different versions of the plaza and the music and everything. Just for that little event that plays every now and then. That's ah, just marvelous. Okay, yeah, anyway, back to work here. Back to what we came for. So. Yeah, I'm. I'm still thinking about my gear set. Because it's so tough to find a, a perfect. Perfect individual gear for yourself. Especially when you have a weapon class that you never played before, like me here. And then it's a, like a special version of that class, like it's a subclass. Oh my god. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, that, I just got reminded of that insane genius that the Snipe Rider is. 
But you will see that in my video though. I don't want to spoil it, but yeah. The, it's a subclass of the Charger. And... Ah, oh, this is so beautiful. It's a subclass of, of the Charger and I never played any Charger class before, so I'm naturally... Yo, I got that guy because he missed the first shot. Yes, yes, yes. I need to get rid of the E-leaders. That's like the job of the pencil, actually. You need to clean up the rain, the the yeah, rainmakers, the <laughs> the E-leader guys. What? Because you can. That's like it's like the anti-E-leader in some way. And it's it's so much fun, honestly. It it feels like I don't know. I love killing E-leaders, it's just like one of the best things. Because they're so tricky, and they're so dangerous, and I don't know, it's it just... I can't even explain. Getting out the- getting rid of the sniper in the team, or... It's, it's mostly actually the E-leaders that are... That, that just have this aura of fear around them. You're so scared. Like, see, approaching that guy is so scary. I'm so scared of getting to him. But then if you overcome this and, like, you actually get him out of the match, like, you, you get the splat on him, it feels so good and so rewarding. No, I couldn't get the first shot. The first one had it. I could have had him. Okay, can you guys not screw up, please? Oh, no. I said not. Oh, my God. Do not screw up. It's like the negative form of screwing up. Can you do that for me? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. What? How? Lord, how the hell? How do we defend that? Oh, I should not do this. Ah, uh, only one hit is so rough that you have to hit the, the E-Lever twice. And they obviously only need one shot. And that just that, that adds to the satisfaction. When you get them anyway, then it's so satisfying. There we go, see? Just again. Oh shit. No! I wasn't sure where to throw the freaking cooler and then I hesitated. Why do I even swim up? Oh, can we get this? No, 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 no. Okay, this is... This time they get through. How the hell? Range blaster, what? Okay, we should actually push. We should actually go proactively and cover some of the other side. Ah, damn it. Nice one, okay. Nice trade. Get that guy. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, shit, we need the checkpoint down. No! Ah, I wasn't sure. I could, I could maybe jump off. Ah, okay, blast us, blast us on tower. That's rough. 
Oh man, I'm so bad. I should have actually jumped off earlier. Nah, this is it. I screwed up. I screwed up again. Ah man. I should have jumped off of the tower before the checkpoint and then threaten the E leader from the back side and not from the from the tower side. And then I could even challenge the the blaster guy that was on the right side. And either they trade kill me or even they just kill me, it doesn't matter. At least we could have burned through the checkpoint in that same time and I could also have the E leader like look away from the tower for a bit and then my two teammates that were one on the tower and one on the right side or behind the tower they could have I guess they could have get the blaster guy that would have killed me and then the E leader takes too long to kill two guys from us and then we could have maybe squeezed out the the lead there ah uh, but I stood on tower because I thought that the blaster guy needed longer time to get to us and then I had enough time to deal with the e leader first getting rid of them and then do the the play to get rid of the blaster I didn't judge the timing correctly. I should have went for the safer way. I went for the more risky way, waiting for the E-leader. That was my bad. But yeah, there we go again. Another two blasters and an E-leader. It's basically a rematch. Steve Steaks Steves Some some waving icons or whatever that is. Yeah, welcome in. Hope you see what you I hope you like what you see. Hope you see what you like, I was gonna say. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know how to spell your name though. How is it going, man? Yeah, it's going decent, I guess. The stream started way early, uh, way later than I expected. I wanted to start this like hours ago today, but I couldn't get it going because there was other stuff in the way and st and whatever. And also, my gameplay isn't as crisp yet, but it's getting better. I think and I had way worse days playing so this is about more more on the good side of okay I would say right now but it could turn bad either like every moment it kind of depends on like if I can keep up my my ah see and <laughs> commentators curse you see if my team makes me angry then I play worse and then yeah it spirals into something not so pleasant I guess you know what I mean uh, no worries all good yeah I try to rank up as well like this is basically what I'm doing right now I'm trying to grind chunks or I, I try to get a pure on my shirt. I want to get all effects to be special power up. And in the meantime I also try to rank up in my rank because I'm still in, in S hell. I'm still trapped in, in S rank. And it's horrible to rank up with the pencil. It is horrible I swear. You cannot carry matches with this thing. It relies a lot on your team and yeah, that's the issue. So I try my literal hardest to get out of this freaking S rank. 
Which is why I have to put a hell lot more effort than I would usually do when I just grind chunks and like nonsense. I usually don't play too much, like too too much try hard. But here I have to play like the, the top of my game basically just to to stick in the same rank, like to not lose my rank. Like, I have to put insane effort when I play this weapon. It's... I don't know, it's kind of draining, but I have to... I want to play more of this weapon because I love it. Uh, carrying with back lanterns is super hard in solo. Yeah, sure. I want to address that this is not a backline weapon, but I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Don't get me started on the rolled stuff again. I I hate I hate arguing with that. I did that way too many times. And it always ends in me looking stupid even though I have I'm basically in the right. So yeah, I I would prefer to not have to discuss this again, but yeah. I will make videos about all that stuff in the future somewhere. But, yeah, let's not spoil ourselves, right? Yes, I got the kill and lived. Uh, speaking of living, that was, I spoke too soon. Okay, still pretty good though to have S rank. Nah, come on, bro. S rank is like nothing. S S rank is like you start the game, you you go to the store, you buy the game, you pop it into your console, you press po the power on button, and you're S rank. That's what S rank is basically. So I don't see S rank as any sort of achievement, it's just kinda holding you out of X rank, that's like the only thing it does. The only job of S rank is to, to freaking get you out of X. I actually like that they D rank you in every season though, cause then you have to work your way through this S hell every season it's horrible and rough and whatever but i actually like it because that way it, it maybe filters out a bit of the a bit of those s guys you know which is good for the higher ranks you should not have like noobs into higher ranks so i really encourage the rank system to be way harder just for the sake of... Bro, what the hell? Just for the sake of, um... Yeah, like gatekeeping, basically. Keeping the, the bad players out of places that they don't want to be in. Oh my god. I'm dead. Ah, no, I was thinking maybe jumping out, but I couldn't get a good spot. So we have the lead, that's fine. How can you see me? I'm on the block. Yes, and I'm still alive. I shouldn't. Oh my god, I shouldn't even speak it out. The moment I say I'm 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 alive, I'm dead. I was too freaking. I should keep that patience at all times. That's so hard. What? I survived the bomb? Okay, not this one. 
Not this one. But the cooler, tag the cooler, if you understand the hitbox of it. What? No, 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 no. I did not stand in that ink strike. But yeah, if you understand the hitbox of the tactic cooler, you can use it as some crazy shield, basically. It has crazy shield uh, uses to it. And I also, the, the whole special is completely new to me. I never used any tactic cooler weapons before. Be it. There we go, okay. We can only no we cannot afford any lose anymore. I need to win all the games now. Hmm. That's rough. But I think we can do it. If we get a decent dish team and I don't rush in too stupidly, I think we can get all the wins because that's really what you see this is really what S rank basically is you just if you keep it together and you just play decently just play oh my god that's one we need only two more but yeah if you play decently in S rank and you just keep yourself together and don't play into this nonsense habit of like throwing games basically if you don't throw your game on purpose by playing stupid i think it's almost it, you are almost guaranteed to to win like you can imagine the same goes for all other players and if you have a, the opponent's team with four people basically throwing and you have your team with three people and yourself all throwing then it's like a coin flip who wins but if you do not throw the game if you actually keep yourself together and stable and everything that's already the difference and you're you're already like yeah in that way carrying your team and it, I'm not saying like you have to get all the kills and stuff. You just want to keep keep playing normal. If you keep it together and stay stay positive and stay like yeah in in a good mindset while you play, that's already it. And that's what I try to do here to not oh man to not get frustrated and go into this like hasty mode and. Yeah, lose it. Like I'm, I try to just not lose it. And I think I think the other squiddles will help you out if you if you keep stable and help them out to also be stable. Ah, why? Why did I even pop cooler there? That makes no sense. But I think your squiddles will help you out if you show them the way. If you show them that you're not throwing no matter what, even if they play like ass, that you still keep faith in them. Ah, not even traded. This is insane. Okay, maybe my, my motivational speech like backfired on me here. But you get the idea. Your squiddles will see your effort, see, and then they will... They will also try to get stable and stabilize themselves and like get into this attitude of... Not playing trash because it doesn't matter, because then they will see, okay, it does matter what they do and then they will maybe snap out of their stupidness. And there you go, then you can like infect the entire online 
Uh, yeah, the entire internet, you can infect them with the, the good... The good mindset, basically. That's what you want to do, basically. Help out the others to get infected by the good. Oh my god, what? What the hell was that even? Yeah, okay, so here it didn't work out. It's fine. And I lost the streak now, but it's fine. See, I'm not mad or anything. It just happens. You cannot win everything. That's it's just what it is. But it wasn't too much of a destruction, kind of was, but even in matches where you get completely demolished, I think you can still if you do certain plays in a different way. Okay, we even had a DC. I didn't even see that. And yeah, that explains a bit. But yeah, even if in matches you get completely demolished, I think you can just... If you do certain plays in a different way, you can already turn the whole game around. It could turn out completely different than what it did. And that's what most people don't really realize. That even when it's a complete destruction, it's not as close, like as, as, how do you say, it's not as hopeless as they think. They think like, oh, I got destroyed, like, and the other team got so and so many kills, a hundred kills, whatever, and we got so destroyed, whatever, but it's not, it's not that dominating. It just looks like you got destroyed, but you, it was maybe not as convincing as as you think. If you just play certain things differently, the whole match could have had a different outcome. Or maybe not the outcome, maybe actually like a, if you have a really strong team and you you still lose to them, it might not change the outcome, but still, it changes how the match looks. Okay, I just I just shot randomly and got a kill. That's nice. That's how I love my aim. No! Ah! I, I, I did jump, I don't know. Maybe the lag still got me. Cool that will be cool that will be broken here. If it slides to that wall then it will break my cooler. So the the special will be just like wasted. If you don't grab your drink before that wall. Okay, nice one. And the uh, I can't see, I couldn't even ah couldn't close my map, I was like not pressing my X button the second time. Excuse me, what was that? Okay, let's go. We need the freaking blaster guy. Get the blaster guy. The thing is, I can't really, like, push in. I can only, like, zone them out with my pencil. I can't actually flank. But I can, like, pseudo flank. It's really weird. It's a really weird, weird, weird thing. And it really needs your team to understand what you're doing. And that's like, that goes for most of my weapons, or maybe it's my playstyle actually. 
But I often have this, this, oh my god, this, this misunderstanding of my teammates. That they don't get what I'm trying, and therefore they can't play off of my plays. But, yeah, that's why I hope to get into X rank so that the, the average understanding should be better. It might not actually be, but it should be. Yes, okay, I got one guy, that's fine. I'm fine with the trade. I'll take trades any day. I'm so fine with trading that trading is like a win for me. Okay, nice one. Ah, oh, not so nice. Yeah, also I need, to, I just figured I need to make videos about all the modes and everything, but I will do that like in the, in the later half of this year. I will start doing more videos and stuff again. Hopefully. Okay, nice. No. No! I should have maybe jumped out, I don't know. Sometimes I don't know how to squeeze out the most of my squid life. Oh, nice one. Okay, I'm gonna jump at that guy. There we go. There we go. I don't know if the jump was worth at the end, but it could have been. Like, imagine they throw a bomb, they throw like something that you cannot avoid. Then you can do that jump trick at the end to get the invincibility of the super jump. And then avoid getting killed by something you cannot dodge. Because you do actually can, you, you can actually dodge it like that. 14? 14 kills? What? How did I even... I didn't even realize I killed anyone. 14? That's like record. We had 13 earlier, but wow, it's even more. 14? I did not realize that I did anyone, killed anyone. Yeah, that's crazy. But yeah, that's nice. So we got three. We need two more wins. We can still bring this whole streak back. That would be fun. I would be impressed. Okay. Yeah, I think my playstyle changed a bit over time. Uh, while I played this weapon, I mean. Because it's just the overall understanding that I don't know. It's I can't explain it. I can't really not explain it. It's some deeper knowledge or deeper understanding that I cannot really express here. That makes you play in a different way. Ah, oh, that was good. That was so good. The bomb was so good. It's 
It's kind of unfortunate that I don't have my uh, my <laughs> lol the drop roll that killed him. No, 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 no. Ah, I should maybe throw cooler first. And then throw the sprinkler after. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh man, the rails sometimes don't work, I don't know why. Okay, fine, I'm jumping out. I get it. No, my aim! I should have killed that other guy too. Oh, the Hydra. Oh, okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's not even the Hydra. <laughs> I confuse it with the Hydra, but yeah, it's almost the same. Actually not, but yeah. It was a splatling at least. Also, yeah, I just realized I'm playing a bit more to my range. Which I guess is what I'm feeling, what the difference is. I think that is this kind of weird change that I mean. I'm playing more to the... To the weapon strength, other than forcing my own playstyle on it. No way, no way. I need to change flanks. We have the lead, but we should push more. We should actually get some more. Oh my god, please, guys. No! Ah! Just one second short. But it's fine. You can die as much as you want. That's always my philosophy. It's it doesn't matter if you die. Dying is not a thing. People care so much like, oh no, I don't want to die there and this this confrontation is too dangerous and whatever. I might die. It doesn't matter, guys. You can die in this game. It's actually good sometimes. He's damaged. He's damaged. Yes. Get on tower. I, I don't know. I, sh I could have jumped for distraction, but I don't feel it's worth Yes, I love that the hits freaking freaking connect. No, the last hit! I missed the last hit! Okay, 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 my team carried me. Ah, oh, stuff like this cannot happen. I had that kill on the tower, but I just missed the last hit. You cannot do that, and that wasn't, wasn't even long range, that was like middle range. You cannot miss those. You need to hit those. Okay, yeah, but that's another win, so we need just one more to finish the streak. I don't even know if finishing the streak with only wins gives you more or not. Because it never feels like I get more when I just fill up the, the streak. I don't know, it feels the same to me. But I don't get how this works anyway.
But I feel maybe we get about 400 points when we win this. And then we're almost out of the negative. Which I did not really expect. And now, see, this time it feels like it, I don't even need too much of the ink recovery anymore. It's just certain matches need it. And others don't. It's really weird. I don't know. Maybe I'm misjudging all this. It's hard to say. Getting gear sets ready, that's really hard. Agent Infinite. And another E-Leader Scope. The Scope variants are... I think easier to deal with. Oh man, oh my god. They killed the other guy too. Oh, that E leader is cracked. You can already tell. Get me on this thing. We didn't crack the checkpoint, damn it. Oh, I feel like that's, that might be a hard match. Very E-leader based match, I think. Okay, there is it. There it is. The, the need for ink, I just felt it. This is where it comes from. The if you have constant pressure, you need like you need to output the the hell out of your tank. I should have jumped to the other guy. Oh no, he just died. No way, no way. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, I'm gonna deal with the E-leader. Oh shit. Oh my god, okay, I need to get, get to a good position. On the very right side. Okay, nice one. Okay, good crab tank. Can we stabilize this? I need... I need to get up there. Why is there always someone in my way? Okay, maybe I should just work my way up. There we go, that's good. Nice. No way! Oh my lord. Yes. I'm hitting shots now, guys. This is so satisfying. No way! How did I not get my drink? Uh. 
it's really still the tactic cooler that I don't master at all. Like, I still have a lot of deficits in the special, in the special use, and obviously in the the mains, the use of the main weapon. So basically, my entire kit is is out of my own mastery. I'm kind of okay with Sprinkler, but what can you even do wrong with Sprinkler, right? So it's not really an argument. How? Oh, yes. Let me get into this. I don't know why I did this. I don't know why I did this. That was good. That was good. Okay, kind of unintentional. I wanted to jump back, but then I slid off and like jumped to the right guy. But this is the sort of stuff that I think is needed for a proper use of the special that is tactical there. You need to master the side jumps and not only you but the rest of your team as well. I think it's a really crazy special if everyone understands it. And it's really a team based special which is crazy. It's kinda a, a bit like bubble blower in Splatoon 2 where you have to have your team utilizing your bubbles in the most efficient way for it to actually have the best impact and there's some other stuff too but I forgot but there's a lot of team based things in Splatoon Okay, so we need one more win. Wait. Wait, what? How are we already minus 70? Did I miss something? What? How did we... What the fuck? How did we get rid of 400 points somehow? What? Something's wrong here. I gotta watch my own stream. How the fuck did we get to minus 70 now? Does anyone know? Did they just give us points randomly? What? What the hell? Can someone, one of you guys, can someone like rewind my stream and check? How the hell did we get to 70 points? Because I did not notice this. I thought we were on minus 470. And now we're out of nowhere on 70. On like double digits. I have no idea. Yeah, same. I don't even understand this. Is that a glitch or something? We did not win the streak, like how the hell did we get points? What is going on? 
I'm pretty sure like when we left Rainmaker, when the mode changed, we had like one more loss, then we started a new streak. We started a new streak. See, look at this. Yeah, that's we had one match left or something or two two losses, then we lost, then we started the new streak. Then there's one win, two losses, three losses, so we actually that didn't count. So two losses, one, two wins, three, four, five wins. Nah, no way. What? LOL. The streak is done. What the hell? Okay, actually, I think the streak was over here. Like, you can see, we won like one, two, three, four, five times. So we got all five wins. And this loss here didn't count because of DC, and we had two losses here. So that is the, actually the streak here. It just showed us something else in the last match, I don't know, that was a dead lobby or something. So as you can see the streak actually ended, but we didn't get shown the score. So we did actually gain the 400 points by that, they just didn't show us. That, that's so weird, but yeah, that's what it is. But that's good, so we pay another time, and if we get this streak going here, if we win all those five matches, then we should be freaking positive for once. Ah, man, that's rough. But it doesn't even end there, like, we just basically start there. If we get positive, we can start grinding for the next rank because we take a, a thousand points I believe to get the rank up match and then we also have to win the streak there but yeah it's getting closer finally and at least we're out of the freaking negatives like I was basically starting to climb back up from minus almost minus 2000 so I made up 2000 points by now and we're almost positive now this is this was a grind I guess when we get positive we can celebrate by some some con shells in the in the shell out machine and the slot machine, we can get some randomness going. See if we get some random rewards out of this. I never had any gold uh, banners. Oh, I almost saved myself. We should be. Nah, okay, no. I thought we should be good for pushing, but nah, they just died. What the hell? Wow. The single lonely bomb on the map and I I just swim into it. to this guy here actually are you joking me my aim is like the worst thing in this 
entire game. Okay, but it's fun. Oh, beautiful. And Kula just ended, you saw that? That's the timing of Kula. So you can do, do like two flanks, basically. And survive it, if you're good. And then it wears off if you have two mains. So that's like the very, very barest minimum that I can accept in my kit. That's what you just saw. That's like two quick flanks or one longer flank and then getting back out. That's like the plan. And that's why I need the two mains of, of uh, sub... Of, of... What the hell is the name? Special power up, you know? That's why I have so much in my kit. Oh wait. That was even two mains and one sub. Interesting. Interesting. That should be... Ha. Ah, okay. It's really rough, honestly. This this weapon is so tricky. You can basically make everything out of it. But my question is what do I make out of it? What do I like best? Maybe I should make two kits. I'm just thinking, but we need the pure anyway. So the pure is like in both kits, involved in both kits anyway. And eventually... Or no, 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 eventually means another thing in English, I just figured. It's not what I mean. I mean, uh, possibly or something. Um, possibly I need... How the hell? I forgot what I was gonna say. Possibly I need... I need to get rid of the the sub defense maybe in my kit. Oh my lord. He just suicided on me lol. He was too scared for, for good reason honestly. Oh get him, get him, get him. How can you lose? How can you lose to a to a heavy? And you have a blaster. Wow. That was a crazy kill. A complex sushi. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what it is. It's a pretty fit fitting name. Ah, oh, my hastiness coming back into into play. Yeah, let's go guys. We need some we need some pushing here. That was unplanned, but it's fine. I need to actually look who is in the back. Uh that's a rough match. I think I wanna clean up on the Oh wow, we got a DC, maybe? Yeah, we got a DC. There it is. Yeah, we can try anyway, it's okay. It's always good training to have the... Like less less squids in your team and still trying. How can I miss that? <laughs> this is impossible. Go in, go in, go in. Go 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 go. We can get this. We can actually get this. Ah, oh, the ink recovery. I got one kill. Get the lead, get the lead. 
No, one point. Oh my god, can we actually? There's no way the angle was enough. Oh my god, I think maybe if we hold this like really tight. I want the trade! I want the trade! Nothing else! Ah, I shouldn't... Shouldn't have challenged that. Nah, no way. Ah, that's too rough. I think if we had a more aggressive push... We might had enough room to make this happen. It's just because the, the lead was so slim that it barely didn't work. Like, we couldn't build a good defense in time. Oh, wow. Go, go, go offense. Go offense, guys. Please. No way. Get out of tower, man. Get get off tower. What are you doing? Why is everyone on tower? Ah, oh, you don't want to get on tower. But I screwed up the torpedo. I should have shot the torpedo. Then maybe set my sprinkler on the back left side of tower. And then hope that I get my charge up in time for the backside to defend the backside, and then yeah, hope that my team doesn't die. But yeah, it was a good showing. 3v4, that was not too bad. And we're level 100 on the catalog, also great. And a 10 10. 10 10 kill count, pretty well, pretty. Yeah, well played. Good, good showing for my standards. Honestly, double-digit kills—that's like rare to me. And I think 14 kills is my record with this, with this weapon. And yeah, if we get a win next time, we can even roll uh, another another slot like another ability in my last slot with the increased odds of the ticket I mean and then we can re uh, yeah we can scrub the slots and then we can pop another ticket and then start from new and depending what we have we might Oh no. No! I can't charge in time. Ah, I don't know. Sometimes you want to go for half charges, but I don't have this in me. I don't have the... the judgment... to get that going. Not enough range. Oh my god. Yes, the trade. That was worth. Nice. Okay. Oh my god, that's dumb. Yeah, let me attack the cool on my team first. Okay, got some painting going. Ah, uh, 
leave me alone. Oh man. Okay, it's fine. Oh my god. The double double spray onto my spot. Can't jump. Oh my god, that's rough. Oh my, I got it. I somehow survived. What the hell is going on with me? How am I so good now? I can't believe this. I can't believe this, what the hell is going on? Am I like actually John Squid now? Winning against all odds, is that what it is? John Squid in the house, what the hell? Hello, would you like some help with ranked? I could help, how can you help me with ranked? It's a, it's a solo thing, isn't it? Like what do you mean by help? Katerina Katsiko I can't spell your name, I'm sorry. Can't pronounce your name. Katerina, I guess. What do you mean by help? I could join you. Yeah, like you can Yeah the thing is I don't really get rank points really. Okay, actually let me pause this here. So you see my rank, my rank is minus something, 200, and I want to rank up, but if we go, if we go open mode, which we can, I mean, I don't really mind it, but rank wise it doesn't really help in the sense of ranking me up. However, the catalog is done, so we go to the, go to claim some stuff now. So a quick intermission, but we can play together, so if you if you want to play with me, it's fine. We can just make a lobby. That's not the issue. I'm just saying that if if you want me to rank up, you should rather not play with me. But if you just want to play with me, if that's the objective, then yeah, we can do that. I'm not that much keen on ranking up, honestly. It's just like a side effect. I I wish to rank up while I grind my stuff, but it's not that important. I would rather have a good win streak going to level up my stuff. That's even more important to me right now. Ah, we don't even have money to reroll. To scrub the stuff. Oh man. Oh man, this is rough. I need money. <laughs> We need to win and get money. Yeah, and we finished the catalog there. Ah, oh, man, okay. Okay, and how did you get second catalog so quickly? <laughs> I guess I just played the game. I mean, it's only second catalog. I I bet that there are people that already have like three catalogs or so, or even more. And it's been one month already, so one month is four weeks, I guess. I guess you just make, you just play like 25 levels per week or so, and then you have it. Guess that's the secret. But how do we do? What do we do now? I need to re-roll my thing. But I don't have money for the re-roll. And I can't spend the, the chunks. Or can I? What if I just spent... Nah, that's 50 chunks. I can't throw away 50 chunks. No, 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 no. That's way too much. That's way too much. 
I kind of feel re-rolling the shoes, honestly. And then grinding for money. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna re-roll the shoes. I'm gonna reroll shoes, then I can make a lobby for you, Katarina. And then we can play together if you wanna carry me. Um, yeah, I'm gonna reroll this. Actually, we have ink resistance on that too. Oh, that's so good. But yeah, I'm gonna reroll this. Scrub that. And then we have. We have a chance of getting the shoes at least. And depending what we get, I can. Yeah, I can deal with that later. But we can pop a money ticket right now. So we don't need those tickets here. We can can go for maybe yeah, double money, that's fine. Well, I don't know, because I'm only A+, plus, so maybe I could rank up. I could rank up now. Yeah, I don't mind. I mean... Wait, how do I even... How do I make you join even? Let's, let's just make a pool here, I guess. Let me make a pool. Yeah, Continental is fine. So you put this as your t as your pool name. Put Continental as your pool name. And then join my pool. And then I can make a can make a lobby. So I'm going to make a lobby with friends here. Create room. No password, you can just join. And I will also do the invitation on the Y button. There you go. So everyone in my pool should have the invitation now. And I'm just waiting here for you to arrive. So if you want to play with me, then do that. I'm putting it in chat. So if you enter this pool name in your game, then you should be able to join me. And yeah, I'm John Squid <laughs> in the game, and that's why I'm I'm sticking to that theme of jo of the John John Wick movies, the John Squid movies. As long as I'm locked into that name, I, I'm gonna use it and make the most of it. Hmm, but I'm a bit... I'm a bit confused. I might... It kind of feels that I'm fine with only a bit of ink recovery. I'm the... I don't know. Okay, let me finish the game and I'll join. Yeah, it's fine. I'm waiting here. Maybe theorizing a bit. I might need swim speed, actually. Or ink... ink I don't know, ink resistance? One thing is for sure. I can say that I do not really need the uh, the special saver. I tried special saver to like s respawn with more special so that I have it ready earlier. That does not help the kit at all. I do not need my special earlier. <laughs> I do not even need to boost it, like special charge is not needed and 
Yeah, special saver is not needed. It's only special power that is needed. So that's all I know so far about the special. Which means that basically whenever I come around those things I can like get rid of those in my in my kit that's what I'm saying but I'm not sure about swim speed if I go for one more swim speed I'm on free subs then and when my comeback activates, I am one main and three subs. I don't know what's the difference between one main and two subs and one main and three subs. If that's really a significant difference. If not, then I might just not do that. If yes, I could consider changing some of my subs to swim speed. And then have free swim speed, but it's kind of a waste because I have cooler anyway, and I have comeback anyway, so I don't know. Hi, sorry. What do you mean, sorry? Hi, Silent Moon, by the way. Welcome in. If you want to change my pool, go ahead. I put the name in chat, so if you want to want to come into my pool your uh, you're welcome is that how you say that because like you're welcome already means something else doesn't it Uh, English is weird, I don't know. Sometimes English is just so limited that I'm confused by how simple it is. Yeah, well guys, I'm still waiting. You can just enter my freaking pool. Go ahead and come. can check my gear okay finished let me join yeah go ahead join me hat trick bill hat what if I go main or swim speed Nah, I think swim speed is not really an issue in that sense. It's very good to have, but I think I can live without. I don't need to spend anything towards that. But bomb defense and ink resistance is kind of bugging me. The bomb defense, for some reason, if you check my freshest fits here, the first set I made is for the chainsaw. And as you can see, in that set, I had two subs of sub defense. And I cannot remember why. Like, that's a long time ago that I made the set. And I'm sure that I knew what I was doing there, but why the hell is it two subs? I tried one sub and then two subs and I'm not sure if that's actually a difference or not. Like from experience it doesn't feel much different, but I'm sure that I knew what I was doing back in that freshest fit here. So... I tried to replicate that and also go for two subs, but I actually don't know why. Okay, I joined the pool, but the invitation isn't sent to me. Uh, okay, then actually let me reset my room. 
So then I can re reinvite people. Uh, and also I want to change my banner. We got this one now. I don't really like that. Let's check this new one out. Nah. I don't like that either. Nah, whatever. Let's use that new one. I'm fine. So, yeah. Uh, new lobby. There we go. And now I can invite you guys again. So if you're in the pool, you should now receive the the invitation. If I do this, you have friends and players in your pool. So you should get the invitation now. And you should be able to join this. Okay, I'm in. That was quick. <laughs> that was that was a lot quicker than I expected. Hello, yeah, welcome in. So you're this N, I guess, in that case. Question is, does someone else join? Yeah, there is. But does someone, someone else? Like, is there even more people? Because if we get four people, then we have a full squad going. I wonder if that is the case. I'm not sure, because there's so far there was only... Katarina uh, saying that they would join and this Chris guy just randomly popped in I wonder if there's more if there, is there one more guy who wants to join otherwise I will just start it so last chance last chance to join Okay, nobody joining. Good. So, let's just start this here. And let's see what we can do here. It would be so crazy if I could jump to my teammates here, uh, to the ghosts. That would be so good. But yeah, I can't. Alright guys, show me what, we, what you can do. Show me your carry. Show me how you carry me. So... Okay... Oh, it's clamless. I didn't even realize. I'm dead. Ah, I try to jump out, but it's you need some time to jump out, which you have to make up first. Okay, that's rough. And see, now I do feel the need again for my ink recovery. There it is. There's the need. I think that's how it... It's, it's, it so depends on the mode. In Clamblitz you need so much coverage of the ground. Hit something for once. That's a new one. Okay, that should be. Should be. Oh, of course, of course. The last guy was there where I jumped.
się. Yeah, we can. Ah, oh, that was dumb. That was dumb. That was so dumb. I wanted to fake an attack. I didn't want to actually attack. But I went too far in already. Then I couldn't go for forward or backward. Okay. Oh my god. That's a that's a pretty bad spot to be in. Oh my god, why? Why do I do this? No, it's gonna be... It's gonna be finish. That could be KO. Unless... Unless... Unless they screw up. Interesting. Oh my god. Ah oh no! Bex had the right idea. The the arrow spray had the right idea. Okay, that's not gonna bait me. I know that's not gonna dunk. Good idea though, but it's not not effective on me. Ah, oh, that was effective though. Can you not defend with a crab tank? Are you joking me? Okay, actually I don't know crab tank too much. I don't never played crab tank. But is it that hard to defend with that thing? Should be able to kill anything. Trade him, trade him. Kill him. Yeah, okay. Okay, go, 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 go. You can push, you can push. It's all open. I'm gonna get more clams here. In the meantime. We can bring this right back. And here's a cooler right in front of their side. Oh my god. Go, 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 go. It's open, it's open, it's open. This is it, this is it. Jump in, jump in, jump in. Stay alive. Oh shit, nah, that's... That was too... Too wacky. We should have, like, set this up a bit better. Like, there was a bit more setup, setup needed for that. Almost good. I think... I think my team wasn't ready for me to push in. I kinda announced it, but I know the stream is laggy and everything, so you, you didn't even hear it in time. But you should have keep track of who is rushing into the other basket and then if you have a lot of clams or if you have like at least seven clams, seven or eight clams, like a super clam or seven clams, you should check the map if you can jump to someone in your team that is pushing up, which is what I did. And then you can make a push going and the others if you don't have clams ready and you're about to collect clams you should check if someone is setting up a push for you and then you want to try to back up that push that's what you want to do basically and I couldn't really do much other than making the push happen Ah, but I died. <laughs> my aim was getting in my way, so I could maybe survive, but I screwed up. So it's part part on me. Sorry, I'm I'm but the best. I'm not the best at clams. 
Yeah, nobody is the best, because there can only be one best, right? <laughs> and if you're not that one best guy, you're also not, not the best. Yeah, but Clams is fun. Clamlets is one of my favorite modes. And it also favors my special here. The Tacticula is really good in Clams. Okay, there we go. God. Okay, I have seven clams. See, I checked the map for openings. There's the Kraken, perfect opening. The thing is, yeah, I'm lacking one clam, that's the issue. That's like, I should have maybe checked if someone else is there with clams, which I didn't. I just like tried to demonstrate my point there and then I screwed it up. Wow. Wow. Oh no. Oh my god. Guys, you want to paint, guys. Paint the paint your surroundings. I was obviously like my jump in was stupid, I admit. But it wasn't necessary me to die there even if I was stupid this should not really kill me yeah see the turf coverage I think it's more for splat zones and for clams that I need the ink recovery I think this is this is it here it's a good test actually, so thanks guys for pushing me into this mode. Wow. I didn't get my dr I did get it, okay. No! Okay, you're there. Wow. Yeah, but it's good that I play something else than Tower and Rainmaker. Because those two modes specifically, they need not too much of my ink tank. They don't demand me to paint the the most of the time. But here, splat zones and clams, they need me to paint the hell out of the map. And therefore I need the ink recovery that I'm going for in my kit. So I finally see or get reminded why I even why I was even going for that in the first place. I'm dead. Wow, I survived guys, can you believe? Also in Clam uh, not in Clam but in uh, in Rainmaker I can see I can see inking be a thing too. Wow, I hit those shots? What the hell? That's how it feels to, to be able to be a sniper? What? It's like a crazy feeling. Feels like I can kill everything. Why do I not get my drink? I should have went for my drink there, but it's fine. It's all fine.
Oh my god, I'm living. We got the lead. No, I should. Oh my god, I couldn't because of Cooler. Oh no. Oh no. I actually tricked myself, guys. I don't know if you realized. I could have hit. I could have hit and waited for the timer to run out and then save one clam and throw that one clam into overtime. And then, like, cancel overtime basically to make us win. But I couldn't hide because I had the cooler effect on me, so they would see me. And I kinda screwed myself by that, but I didn't plan to do that in the first place, that's why I grabbed my cooler. Otherwise I could actually not grab my cooler on purpose. And then stay hidden. But yeah. Who thinks that much in so little time, right? Swim speed! Oh my god, swim speed is sick. I can now actually test how swim speed feels. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's so good. In case I end up using free swim speeds, which I doubt, uh, I would obviously have to remake my set once again to make it like look better because it's all about the aesthetic I just want my gear set to look good if like if if I kill someone and they see me in the kill cam look at my drip in the kill cam I want them to see the perfectly aligned uh, effects and all that stuff on my gear and yeah that that's kind of what I'm trying to go for here. If I would just go for the effects then I could just use my chunks and like spread them out so that they cost me the the least the least amount of chunks and I would already have everything but I, I want to go for the, the look. It's all about the look here in Splatoon. <laughs> yeah, it's not, but yeah, I want to look good here in my drip. Competitive drip is like a, a huge deal. I don't even know why it's called drip, to be honest. Why do people call looks drip? Like, what? what is even dripping? Wow. Okay, nice, they got killed. There's one more. There's also dead. It's all free, guys. When you got two down, what are you waiting for? Just go in. Just go in. Don't hesitate, just rush it in. No matter what, just, just go for it. There we go. Exactly like that. Just go in, throw your clams in, extend the push, just like that. And keep it going as long as you can. Because that is the actual defense. So if you just randomly push, you can prevent the other team to push in that time. So it's basically the defense of, of Clan Blitz. There we go, nice one. Ah, what? Ah, that can slash through the cooler, I forgot. No, 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 no. That was my fault. But it's okay. Since we pushed first, we have no issues for them to push. We're still in the lead even if we, if they get to the same the same point. Why am I jumping straight? It's so dumb. 
I don't understand. I should jump to the right and then back to the middle. Why do I jump straight? Nice, that was 40 damage by the sprinkler. Ah, okay, nice one. I was thinking of tap shot, but my teammate got this. Nice. Okay, not so nice, but whatever. At least they are scared of someone coming in, which is exactly why I, why I went there even. Okay, let's go. Why don't you throw it? Are you like crackening or what? Ah, uh, probably. Nice one. So this time straight, going straight was the right play. But it's hard to judge the distance. I think you cannot throw it right away. You need to like walk through the ink a bit and then you can like get the throw here. You need to cross like this line or something. need to come back. Oh shit. Ah, oh, my hesitation comes in. Or my hastiness, I don't know how you say it. What the hell? Okay, good job. I think if you set up your sprinkler in the dead center of the jump, I believe it kills. I believe it's like unavoidable to be killed by it, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh no, can I get free clamps? Nah, no! They have no super clam? Nani? They just throw away the game, what? They gave up, basically. Okay, whatever, I take it. Good job, guys. Good job, guys. Let me get a pullover real quick. Let me like stand up. I'm gonna mute myself for a second and then I'll put my pullover on. So excuse me for a second. I'm right back. I'm right back. Got a pullover on. It's a bit cold here in my room. But I guess we can make up for that with some hot gameplay, right? So. Oh my god, imagine I hit that. Oh, that would be so sick. Unflappable grandma, oh my god. Okay, nice push. Ah, damn it, my, my gyro is all over the place. Oh, 
there's nobody there. Okay, I got six clams, which is really bad if you want to defend. Uh, I need two more clams somehow. What? Yeah, that was horrible of me. I admit that was all my fault. I couldn't defend because I had six clams. Then I got killed because I was looking for clams. That was horrible. But yeah, that should be it for that push. Yeah, nice. Oh, not so nice. Okay, they only got one clam anyway. No! Oh my god. Oh, that's rough. Okay, go, 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 go. We're ready, we're ready. Push in. Hello? How is he alive? Oh wait, I miscounted. That was two hits and, and my tap shot, that's 80 damage. Ah, damn it. I thought I had the, the kill confirmed, but like, that was just 80 damage. Yeah, sometimes it's, it's not, not at all fun to kill. Why? Okay, it's fine. Yes, it is. Very good, very good, very good. Good threat at least. Didn't work out, but it could have. If you could have get that push going. Holy crap. That was. No. Okay, we got a counter push. We got a counter push this. Ah, uh, the freaking chainsaw guy. That's that doom squid guy. That's really annoying. Okay, I'm kind of panicking for some reason. We should paint, guys. I'm just saying, we need the stage. It doesn't matter the score, we need the stage first. Get the stage, and then we can work fr from that. We need the stage. You can't do anything without the stage. Need we get the stage first. Trade him! Trade him! What are you doing? Ah, man. Oh, we might lose this. I can't challenge this guy, that's the issue. Okay, let me see if he gets killed. No. Nobody has a claw. <laughs> I hate matches like that. I hate this. Ah, man. That's what let that's what gets me frustrated. Cuz I feel I can do little with my weapon here. I cannot really defend properly. And I can only set up something for the offense. I cannot also really press in myself. All I can really do is paint basically and yeah, put put some tacticulas out. 
And that has to be enough for my team to do something. Which it seems to not be. Okay, wait, let me change the... No, wait, not this. Let me change the banner. I hate this banner. This looks like trash. Mm. Give me something... Maybe this... I think the purple is the most fitting. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the purple. Just a simple purple, that's fine. Okay, guys. Lobby is back open. <clears throat> <clears throat> what is even the mode? I didn't look. Rainmaker, okay. Rainmaker is the mode. Yeah, here's the invitation. There we go. What's the mode for solo? Can't see it. Zach GGP, I think I know that guy. I might know that guy, I'm not sure. I saw him. Or her, I never know. Like, genders, I, I don't care about genders. I just, my go-to is like, I call everyone he like male basically so if you're offended by that then sorry <laughs> but it's just my go-to i just by default i call everyone like he or him or whatever so okay nobody else joining then that should be it then let's go three people, it's fine. I like the background music. It's like so chill and like the, I think there's two musics, this one and another one that I really like in the lobby and it just has a special taste or a special feeling to it which I guess every music has but I mean special in the in terms of Splatoon y special in combination with the with Splatoon, the feeling of Splatoon. It's like I don't know. It's a special nuance of that special feeling. In some way. I can't explain. I shouldn't be grabbing it. Ah, I'm alive, okay. What the hell? He slipped through that explosion unharmed. Weird. Ah, can I just hit them twice? <laughs> Yeah, whatever. It's a decent lead. I 
kind of wish to play splat zones now just to compare the ink consumption that I need. Holy crap, okay, I'm dead. Mm. Oh, please. Can you guys... Oh my god, why would you not care for the pop in that place? How? Uh, anyway, at least we don't lose any points here, really. That's like the good part about, about the open mode. But still, I'm losing ticket things, ticket matches. I need to gain more money here. We are only on 20k. We need 40k for two rerolls. Also, I should pay attention to swim speed. I didn't yet. Let me see. I honestly don't think it changes too much. Swim speed f feels almost the same. But it's also, I didn't really pay attention. a leggy match. Yeah, I need a hell lot of um, of ink here. No! Bait them behind that block. What are you doing? Yeah, I was misjudging that situation, honestly. That was my. That was on me. Yeah, they got cooler too. I just let go. I couldn't get let go. I don't know how smart that was, though. That was not smart at all. Oh my god. Okay, he's dead. He's not. And he's on all swim speed and respawn punisher. What? That's a weird one. Oh shit. Can't challenge Hydra's output. Get the pop, guys. Ah, uh, see? This is why. I told you. Get the pop. I 
can't do nothing here. Oh man, please. Don't throw this lead away, please. It's not worth. Could technically camp this, but I don't like that. I'm not a fan of camping at all. Where is this guy? Ah, that was so dumb. Get the pop, get the pop. Oh my god. No! Okay, okay, okay. That should be... No, 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 no. Yeah, that should be it. If I don't do anything super duper stupid. Like running into that bomb or something. Or getting killed from some random angle. Yeah, it should still be it. There we go. Okay, yeah, good. They went for Booyah Bomb at the last second, that's so dumb. Okay. Kinda wacky win. I didn't feel any of my swim speed though. I don't think swim speed is needed. Sometimes it is, but I mean, sometimes everything is needed. But in general, I don't really miss the swim speed too much. Yeah. Just wondering still about the the two subs of sub defense. If they are really needed or not. If I can go without, then I should maybe make up two slots. And what do I want to use? If I had two slots, I would I guess I would go for swim speed. Just because it's always useful. Or I could even go for more um, special power, which I originally did. I had like two mains and two subs or three subs. Wow. I died because... Because of ink resistance. I think. Let's go. 
Wait, what? I did squid search. I should be invincible. And maybe it didn't come out. I don't know. Okay, nice. Oh man. Okay, I'm living. Get to Wow! I always, I swear, I always die to the last hit of ink, uh, ink jet. Always. It's some, some unwritten rule that you have to die to the last shot of ink, ink jet. All the time. Yeah, guess what? Guess what? I'm dodging everything except... Okay, that was good. That was a nice trade. Still need to need to work on my aim. Ah, <laughs> cool! That takes so long. I got 80 on him, come on. Oh, we gonna throw this. Gonna throw this so hard. Yeah, I need ink recovery here for sure. How do I not hit this guy? That's ridiculous. Okay, that was very dumb. If you get the Rainmaker, you don't want to rush in in overtime. That's just, it's never working. Never. It only works if you just have a fresh wipeout on the other team and you want to rush ASAP. But even then I would be careful. Okay, hmm. Not very convincing, honestly. Uh, also not a good ability. What do I do with act, uh, action intensifier, intensify action? I did think of this even on this weapon, but it's not needed at all. I mean, not even the tap shots have any sort of accuracy check. 
they're just straight up where you point they they shoot where you point and that's it there's no randomness in the shot And basically, squid rolling can be enhanced by action intensifier and the squid surge, but none of those is needed either. So I guess action intensifier is completely worthless on my weapon. I don't see any use at least. Wow. Nice leggy bubble. Okay, we're gonna eat those points. can the freaking tri slusher hit me that far up I did not expect this at all Maybe I shouldn't jump, maybe that's my issue. I always jump on my shots. I think on a sniper that's a dumb idea. But it's so like deeply ingrained in my habits. Really hard to get rid of that. What? Okay, that was ground. I thought that was water. Cooler is done, right? I'm done. Wow. right guy what are you even doing dancing there in the back with some other guy okay we got a DC great ah, we could still make this happen but I don't know oh no wait they got a DC I, I completely mistook the team gonna explode anyway okay then yeah we still don't have the lead but this is shouldn't be an issue here Wow Yeah, jumping isn't too bad, but still, I feel like in a lot of positions, a lot of situations, ah, okay, I baited him at least. Get the lead, guys, what are you doing? 
Just get the freaking lead for once. Don't stall time. Go, 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 go. Okay, good. Now you can joke around. When, when we have the lead, it's all good. That... what? Okay, a random E-leader shot through the Rainmaker barrier. Fine. Oh, that was insanely dumb of me. Insanely dumb of me. I don't know how, how I managed to die to that try. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, let's fill up this last slot and then I don't even know. No, I need the 40k for two rerolls. So I have to keep going on this ticket. Either way. Yeah, I'm getting a bit tired already. I don't really know why, but I guess the, the whole week and everything was pretty hard. Or last week in that case. Okay. Yeah, Raymaker is kind of, kind of bad for my weapon, like for the whole kit, figuring out the kit and whatever. It's kind of a really bad representation. Because you gotta play a bit differently. So dumb. I also I don't have my my set ready right now. I'm we're on the random uh, slotless set, which is obviously without the the ink ink recovery. Get this guy! Come on. He he was damaged. How can you not finish? Yeah, the guy is hella distracted by me. Get the pop. Okay. Don't tell me I'm dying. No. This map is also not so funny. It's kind of hard to play here in that little... Yeah, cage basically. You have so little room here.
what the hell? And we got a DC, great. What is going on with the online man? There's so many DCs lately. I have no idea what that is. Nova? What? I thought Nova cannot kill, but I just got killed by it from I don't know where. What? You can pick up Rainmaker with the Kraken? I never played Kraken, so I don't know, but that's sick. That makes sense, of course. You just touch it and you got it. And it cancels your Kraken. Makes sense. Yeah, you see me, I drive back to my habits to like tap shotting randomly. Not taking my aim and everything, not taking my time. <laughs> Lol, that fight. Imagine I somehow turned around and tap shot him twice or something. Okay. Yeah, there's no way we bring this back. No way. Absolutely no chance. Yeah. Whatever. These seas just suck. Ah, and this map also sucks. I say it. I say it out. I... Especially Rainmaker here is rough. It's so little space. Yeah. I'm not sure if I can go on here, if my party will... Let me try. Yeah, the, the squad is still there. But I think someone... Yeah, and disconnected. Even a while ago, even two matches ago, what? Where did you go, N? Okay, also this other guy, Kuroi. Kuroi. Also switch to someone else. Hmm, weird. So yeah, some people, some people left already without a word. <laughs> yeah, I might switch back to solo mode, honestly. I'm not feeling this here. Not too much fun. No offense, like it's not the players really. It's just the map and mode is, is really basic. No, don't die. Okay, good. Okay, keep the cooler for just now. 
There we go. And there we go. Gotta survive one more wave. And squid surge. There we go. Okay. That's how I like my matches. <clears throat> that was like the tacticula coming in play here. A bit at least. But yeah, that's that's a quick and easy way to get wins. That's how I like it. Four kills, zero deaths, one Kula. That's how I like those matches. That's also one reason why I like Rainmaker, because stuff like that can just happen there. But also the other way around. Okay, I guess even that other guy left now. So we're all on random new squids. Which means it doesn't matter if I leave the lobby now. Uh, yeah, I'm a bit tired, honestly. I don't know what to say. I might end stream soonish, I think. I also gotta sleep, as I told you, for tomorrow. I don't know. Hey, sorry I left. I'm N. My phone died. This is an alt account. I have to leave, so bye. I hope I catch more of your streams, by the way. When do you stream? I have no stream schedule, unfortunately. I can't really say when I stream the next time. I will do regular streams in a couple months, but not now, so in the later half of this year you will see me streaming more. However, I try to stream occasionally when there's like a specific thing to stream or like so something that's worth streaming, such as Splatfest or something. Events like that is likely to see me streaming if I can afford it. Or I will announce it in my Discord if I if I'm up to something. So you can just join my Discord if you wanna have the, the updates and everything and know when I'm when I'm gonna do something with my channel. But other than that it's really kinda random. So I can't really give any estimations when the next time is. I hope that I that I'm free on the weekend for the Splatfest but I can't say for sure at this point. I need to see how, like, if I'm busy there and gotta work and whatever. I'm not sure. So, yeah. I guess the best bet is to join my Discord and see what, what I'm up to there. I will announce everything in my Discord. So, if you're there, you will catch me. So, yeah, thanks. Thanks for joining though, thanks for the games, thanks for the motivation, thanks for chatting. What's your discord? You can, sh it should be somewhere in the description, just go down in the description, it should be somewhere there. Or also it's on my channel, in my, in the channel banner, I think there's a link, you can also use that. Shouldn't be too hard to find honestly, I hope people can find it easily. So, just check the description and see if you can get there. <clears throat> Alright, I need one more win I think and then I can... I will take a brief break I think, I need to go to the restroom. 
And then we also continue the solo grind because I want to get in the positives in the ranks. And then, depending if I'm... I don't know, I'm, I'm pretty tired. Oh, that was close. Okay, let's see. No. Ah, only one out of two. Okay, thanks. I joined you. Bye. Yeah, thanks for joining. See you next time. And yeah, thanks for the games and stuff. And good day, good night, good whatever. Should do more tap shots, I think. Whoa, that was nice. Always just satisfying to get the the random kills. Oh, another one. There we go. That's what I'm talking. Get the pop. Nice, nice, nice. I could charge up in time. Hi, Dominic Z. Hi, welcome in. What's up? What is popping? <laughs> the hammer in the face. Newbie, yes. Oh, long time no see. Actually, that's not true. I think you were there last stream. For the 400 sub special, I think you were there. So that's not a long time ago, that's just a few days. Ah, come on, get him! Ah, unfortunate. Yeah, I was. Yeah, I know you were. Okay. Throw bombs, guys. Both guys have, have bombs. I don't understand this. How can you not throw bombs in Rainmaker? Can you believe? I got the Metal Disney, the Off-Road 500 to protect and surf gift pack today and I found it for a really great price. What the hell? I don't even know what that is. I think Mattel makes some, like, board games and stuff. Disney. Mattel Disney. The Off-Road 500. I have no idea what that is. No clue what you're talking about. But yeah, if you got it for a good price, I guess that's good. The gift pack is a part of the die cast line. <laughs> Actually, I have no clue. I'm not that like 
knowledgeable in terms of Disney stuff anyway, and also Mattel or whatever. The, the board game stuff, I'm also not that into it. I know some stuff, but only like the classics. Nothing too fancy. And yeah, I don't know. I need one more win here so that I can get the slot filled up. But I'm kind of tired and dizzy a bit. That's why I want to take a quick break and like go to the restroom and like get some get some fresh air here, maybe open the window quickly. And then I want to finish the money ticket here. And maybe get get my solo rank into the positives. Ah. Nobody's behind. Those two guys, what are you doing? Boogerman, what is Boogerman doing in the back with the sploosh? Or splash, or what is this even? Splash, yeah. Why would you hang in the back? I'm living somehow. I'm living somehow. No, I couldn't squid surge. See, I, if I had more uh, more cooler effect going, then I, I could maybe squid surge up there. Or if I space the tap shot better. Okay, nice, nice ambush here. I must say. Good wait, good kill. Are you joking me? Oh my god, that was rough. The pack was released in 2015, so that means that this set was released during the diecast car collections era of the toy line. Okay, nice. Also 2015 was when Splatoon released, so that's what I know about that year it's a pretty epic year 25 uh, 2015 I mean uh, 5 was also crazy 5 was a nice year too but 2015 is like iconic for Splatoon obviously and if that toy line also started there that, that must be a good sign Okay, we got 40k. Seven more tickets. Yeah, also I gotta refill my drink here. I'm all out on my drink. <clears throat> and it's already 11 p.m. here where I am, so I'm just saying I have to sleep at some point. My original plan was to sleep at at zero or twelve. But yeah. Fun fact, David Bean. Oh, nice crap, nice crap. Crap to counter the 
the firepower. Oh, that was dumb. Fun fact, David, Bean and many other truck characters were only released as deluxes uh, ever since the early start. Yeah, I'm sorry that I have no clue about those kind of stuff, those, those toy lines and stuff. I'm not into that at all. I have never had any contact with those things in my life, so I can't really say much about that. Actually nothing. <laughs> but I guess, I guess you know what you're talking about, I hope. And yeah, if you got that for a nice price and for the, for the for the collection thing, then yeah, good stuff. No, no, I knew I would get killed by the torpedo. Couldn't avoid it anyway. The bean diecast was exactly as big as the story set variant story set variant so wait there's a story about the toys even this is getting out of hand no oh, that was a dumb cooler worst cooler ever Wow, everyone died. Great stuff. Why would you jump to me? Ah, screw this match. Also, die cast? What does that even mean? Let me google this, honestly. I'm kinda interested. Just die cast. Maybe that's some word that I don't know. Ah, I see. I see, okay, it's some sort of car, I guess. But that's what I thought in the first place, so... Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I'm still not filled up on that slot. I still need one more win. The story sets were released for recreating your favorite scenes from the movie. Which movie? Did you mention any movie? You only said Disney something. Disney Off-Road, Off-Road 500, I don't know what that is. If that's a movie then I've never heard of it. I only know like the big stuff. If it's like a niche product from Disney then I don't know. I only know like the big stuff, Disney stuff. And by no, I mean I I heard of it or maybe saw it, but I have zero like expertise in it. But Off Road 500, never heard of that. But I get what you mean when you say like recreating the, the scenes. Basically I had some Lego sets back then that had the same kind of purpose. You just want to recreate the, the scenes from the movie. From a movie and like maybe give it your own touch or think of your own stuff with it maybe. Whatever childs do you, you know, children, children stuff. 
How can I not kill this guy? Ridiculous. He lived? Yeah, I used to have a... Uh, I don't even know how it's called. I, I used to have a bunch of Lego sets from the first... Um, uh, the first Star Wars movie. And like, by first I mean the... The first of the second trilogy, so the... Yeah, episode one, you know. Episode 1, like the prequel trilogy. I had a bunch of sets for Lego for that one. I, I pretty much enjoyed it. It was pretty fun. But I did also recreate basically some stories there, but I gave them my own... My own endings or my own... Yeah. My own reprint. Okay, I'm going for more solo here again. Because I need to rank up my rank. <clears throat> but yeah, I also need a little break soonish. Or not really a break, but I gotta go to the bathroom. So yeah, matchmaking, very interesting. I also had the story set, Race for the Finish Line, which was based on a scene from the first movie from 2014. Race for the Finish Line. Yeah, I can't can't comment on that, I'm sorry. As I said, I have no idea what those movies are even. I'm not that much into movies. Despite working in a cinema, lol. But yeah, I don't have much to do with movies, honestly. I never had. I was always more of a... More of an interactive guy in terms of like games and stuff. Oh wait, it's splat zones, I just realized. That's my my nightmare mode. And there you see it. I need the ink recovery. There it is. There's the need. That's how I came even with that idea. You need mad amounts of ink ink output. God. Get the zones, guys. Please. Please get zones. Get the other zone. Ah, oh, it's so a such a massacre here. Insanely hard to play this mode. Yeah, 
insanely hard and on this map it's ridiculous this is insanely ridiculous ah oh, my aim again and nobody painting in my team what is this they have all paint weapons they can't paint what the hell My shaky aim coming again. Okay, nice one. Should try to hold this here. Ah, not like this. What is my team doing, man? Come on. Come on, guys. Get the zones. Like, I distract them like half a minute. Screw this. Seriously, if my team does not want to win, or if they even prefer to lose, if they do everything to lose, then what can I do? I just have to grant them their wish. That's all I can actually do. Yeah, screw this. They don't want to win. Okay, it's fine. Then we don't win. Get your wish. And I'm heading out of this damn lobby. The off-road 500 was done by the same guys that did cars and planes and this film was released one year after planes. Okay, I'm not sure if I even heard about that. But I know cars and planes, that's, that's at least something. I think I only have seen the first Cars movie. Not the plane movies. But yeah. I'm also not into that kind of stuff anyway. Which is why I don't know those movies, obviously. But yeah. I wonder if it's an animated movie or a real movie. Because Off-Road 500, that kind of feels like... I don't know, sounds like a real movie to me. But you never know, it could be anything. And if you say Cars and Planes, those are like animated movies. So I guess it must be the like concluding concluding from what you said it sounds like it must be an animated movie then and off-road 500 that sounds like a like a truck movie or something it sounds really like like big trucks or so to me if I were if I was to guess I would say like it's about trucks or so Okay, I should maybe flank here. Oh my god, I almost live. The Offered 500 was an animated movie. Yeah, that's what I was guessing. And I, my guess is it's about trucks. That's what I say. If I have to guess, I would say it's like about the about big trucks or something something like Optimus Prime you know the car version of Optimus Prime that's how it sounds to me some big truck story 
I swear, this is what I'm saying. Like, people do not understand Splat Zones. They don't care for this mode. I don't care either, but like, they... Ah, oh, man. What's so hard about painting one spot and then waiting? What is so hard about it? It's like one simple rule, nothing else. Here's the entire plot of the first movie, Stella, a 1963 Volkswagen Beetle gets challenged by an off-road gang for a race and Stella won at the end, lol. Nice story. That's like most Disney movies are kind of basic, like the child's movies at least. The children stuff, the kids movies, they're kind of basic, but I guess it's not the point to be like super crazy or something. It's that the point is rather to have something fun to look at and like the performance and the, the animations, the expressions of the characters, stuff like that. It's not really about the story there. The point is more like to have the, the fun feeling and maybe the maybe jokes and stuff involved in the dialogues stuff like that it's more about fun than any deep deep meaning really mostly sometimes it is but I don't know much occasions where I had a good message in a in a like fun movie if that makes sense but yeah. Okay, we need to win this match. If we lose this match, then we lose the streak. We need to win this. Send your booyahs, I need to win. But they got a they got a Hydra, that's good, and they got a blob. Chances look not too bad. You got the Hydra, I'm dead, yeah, it's fine. Why don't you flank, guys? What are you waiting for? Damn it. Overestimated myself there. Oh, I shouldn't sacrifice myself. Go to the sides. What are you doing? Watch those guys, man. They are doing nothing. They just wait there. What is this? Uh, I I actually I kind of fell asleep. I was I was really distracted by the blob. I thought we had the zone anyway, so I didn't care, but uh, that was actually on me, but that's something else, like, I'm not throwing, I'm just like, okay, whatever, didn't pay attention for a second, that's okay, something else than trying to lose with at all costs. Guys, the zone, hello. Wow. Guys, can you please paint zone? Hello? 
There's a freaking space in the center of the freaking map. How about freaking paint? Paint it, guys. Oh my god, I'm losing it. And now go to the flag. When you have the zone, just wait. And you can wait wherever. You can wait here on the side of the map. This makes no sense. This makes no sense. No, 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 you're not dead. Kill him! Are you joking me? There's no way he survived. There's no way. How did I miss like 50 shots? There's no way. This is ridiculous. Okay, I'm gonna get on their snipe. I don't care. Get zone, guys. And get the snipe. You don't... Can you just not let the Hydra charge? Paint that shitty place in the middle of the map, please. Oh my god. Paint this, guys. Paint. Uh, I cannot do it myself because my weapon is too slow. Do you understand? No, you don't. Of course not. Paint this. Come on! Paint the zone! Bro, are you joking me? Like, are you actually joking me? This is... this is ridiculous. How? Should I show you something? Like, there was a T-Tech on my team. Should I show you something? Should I actually demonstrate you something? You want to see something here. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to show you. I'm going to freaking show you. Uh, okay, Kim was based on a 2009 Pon Pontiac Sol... Blah, I, I don't know. Bean was based on a uh -huh, uh -huh, truck. Sonoka based on a Ford Mercury, Ford Fairlane, okay. Yeah, I don't even know cars in the first place, so that also doesn't say, me, say much to me. But I wanna freaking ask you guys, what in the fuck did happen in last match? Look at Big Mac John, look at that guy, please. He has a T-Tech. He has a ridiculous amount of painting. And for some goddamn reason he could not paint. How? I want to just show you this. Like, I never ever in my entire Splatoon 3 career touched this weapon. I can't even prove it. Look at this. Freshness, zero points. I did never touch this thing. Now watch this. Now watch this. I have this thing. The first time ever I play this. I, I show you something. I show you how hard it is to paint the middle of the map. I'm gonna show you. With this weapon. I also actually never played the special that this kit has. So the only thing I know is bird is the yeah, the bombs. And I'm on in an extremely unfitting gear set on top of all things. I have zero expertise with this weapon. I don't even know how much damage it does. 36, okay, so that's a 
three shot kill, yeah, fine. So that's all I know. Nothing else. Literally nothing else about this entire kit, which also has wrong gear on it, probably. Most likely. So how in Cephalo, Cephalo God's name could I ever win anything with this weapon? Tell me. It should not be possible at all. But now watch this next match. Watch this match. So... Although there was also a DeLorean character that always crashed all the time throughout the off-road franchise. And he actually got hurt by a bunch of bulldozers at the end credits in the seventh film. Okay, nice. But here, look at this now. Look at this. I just pressed the ZR button. That is what I'm doing. I press ZR. There's the zone. There it is. How hard is that? How freaking hard is that? Press one single button and then wait. Oh my god. Yeah, how is that hard? How is that freaking hard? I never played this weapon. Ever. Like, this is the first ever match. This is the first ever match I play. My team is dead by what? <laughs> what the fuck? I'm losing my mind. What the hell? This is actual hell. This is S. This is S rank, guys. This is exactly what I mean. This is S rank. S like S S same. I I don't know any any like acronyms to S. But how is it? What are you doing? Bro, I swear. What is my team doing? Like, actually. Are they actually waiting to lose? There's no way. What are you doing on the side? Fuck off. Go to that side. What are you doing on our side? Yeah, sorry for the sorry for the wording, guys. Like, what the hell? I'm just losing my mind on this. Oh my lord. I got wipe out after wipe out after wipe out. I'm doing like everything here. Despite never touching this weapon. Tell me what the hell is going on? How is this even possible? Pain zone, I swear to god. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. How is this even like so such close match? When, when they're always wiped, like, I only get wipes here, every time. They actually managed to lose this. Can you believe? But you can see, this is not my fault at all you can 
this is the actual demonstration to show you guys what my team is trying the entire time. Here you can clearly see that it was their fault. In whatever I do, they try to like lose somehow. They do everything in their power to lose. Look at this. What are you doing in the back? Dealing with the roller? How about don't care? It's not the objective to get a f rid of a one roller guy. Guys! Bro, go, go in. Oh my lord. Okay, see, but what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. But I'm just saying, like, T Tech can paint the zone. Just, like, press the button and paint. That's all I wanted to show here. So I'm switching back now, but what the hell, man? can't be that hard like 15 kills on my very first ever match of my life 15 kills <laughs> this is what the fuck and I'm I painted the most on my team got the most kills <laughs> I don't know this is insane Okay, whatever. So we need one match for the ticket thing. Oh man, those guys make me lose my mind. <clears throat> okay, um... The diecast collections that were around in that area were old timers, off-road city, fire department, jokesters... Townies, scavenger hunts, lights and sounds, quick changes. Okay. Okay, I guess those are just the names of the collections. Yeah, you said that. But what do I do with that information? That's what I wonder. What do I do with those those names? Okay, let me see if I get this one win. And then I will quickly go to the bathroom as I told you. Wow, I missed that shot. There we go. You want to go to that side, exactly. That's a that's the first teammate playing the game. I go here and abuse my my range. What do you do then, huh? 
Nothing. You just give up because you can't reach me. That's what you do. There we go. That was like the chase of hell. Yeah, that's fine. No, 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 no. I need that one hit. Okay, that two guys on the right, one is behind. Should be only one left. If I got that tap shot, I had him. But this map is just rough. Ah, I don't know what to do. This is hard. This is really hard. We gotta. We need the zones. ASAP. Okay, we got it. Yeah, I can read your stuff after the match. I'm just. I'm too busy looking at the screen. Can't really read anything. Oh, I am dumb. I didn't think of the rain. Okay, they DC it, that's great. I'm taking that. Should get that. Okay, nice one. Good. Okay, <clears throat> the only two packs that don't make sense. The only two packs that don't make sense were the ones from the Best Buddies collection, especially the one with Patrick, Pace, and Echo. They were from two different off-road pieces of media. Echo is from the short Protect and Surf, and Patrick Pace is from the third movie. I still don't really know what you want to say. I don't really get what you try to, s to tell me. Uh, wait, what's the money? 60k? We can reroll. Can reroll maybe both. Hmm. Okay, actually, let me let me take a quick break and like go to the toilet. Then I'll be back and 
we decide if we wanna go for two rerolls or only one and then we pop one more ticket I think and maybe play that out and then that should be should be it for the day then but yeah give me a second I'm right back it's gonna be like yeah very shortly so yeah see you All right, I'm back. I think it's actually the air in my room is really gone. I think that's what makes me dizzy. Uh, yeah, but whatever. So I guess, I guess we reroll both. And then we just try to gamble gamble once again for the reroll to be the same effects and uh, DD and echo would have made more sense yeah I don't know any of those characters from the Disney stuff so I can't really say anything about it to the lobby and then we, we pop the ticket for the drink and then we try to not not lose to our teammates stupidness and maybe we get lucky to roll two same effects Yeah, let's see. Let's just see what happens. Three more wins, then we should be out of the negatives. And then 20 matches, I don't know, that's... It's like three... Three streaks, maybe? Three streaks after this, and then that should be the stream. I can't do much more, it's just time-wise I basically would have to end it around now-ish. 
But since I have to work later tomorrow, I can extend this by a little bit. But also, I'm, yeah, I'm not too much motivated anymore. I'm like tired and my room has no oxygen, so it's not the best. Not the best conditions here. Okay, let's press in. There we go. Oh my god, please. Why do you not move up? Why does nobody move up in my team? They just give up the middle. God. What was that? Okay, nice. At least one guy flanks. That's something. Ah, oh, one more hit. Ah, oh, that's rough. An officer Patrick Pace is from an American rescue team. I only know like a Lego set that is about rescue stuff. I even forgot how they were called. Was it like... I think it was R-E-S and then Q. Like the letter Q. I think it was a pun on... Or a kind of a wordplay to rescue. Ah, the drink didn't come in. Come in time. And guess what? My team froze my damn control away again. Wow, this hit me. Go in, guys. Paint. Okay, good. They actually did it. Okay, left side too. Okay, uh, let's get the lead, please. I do everything for the lead. What? What killed me? What? Inkjet was dead already. What, what do you mean, Inkjet? Paint, paint, yeah, okay. Ah, oh, can you not just treat that guy? Oh my god. See, how do the other teammates, or how does the other team in general, how do they paint our side when they never come to us? Tell me. Like when the strat was to never go to the other side of the map, the map which my team is doing, they follow that rule of never. Ah, fuck it. Ah. <sighs> 
Nah, I don't want to explain this even. If they go by that mindset to never cross the middle line of the map, then how in the fuck does the other team come to our side? If that is the rule, huh? Tell me how that's a, that's a thing. <sighs> it just doesn't make sense. I'm so frustrated by this. See, I don't, I can't keep going on on that nonsense. We need those wins. Why is it splat zones now? Why? Why of all modes? Why not just whatever? Even even Rainmaker is better. Nah, okay, whatever. I just want another lobby and not those guys again. Yeah, I don't know how many levels we reached so far, but look at this freaking lose streak. Like, that's... Six loses in a row, like what the hell? What are you even doing? <sighs> also the matchmaking takes forever man, it's every every lobby takes like two minutes. That's way too long. Okay, this was one minute, but come on, a minute? <clears throat> okay, at least some booyahs to start off. That's something. Got the trade, that's something. He is not even damaged by forty damage. Is that what you're saying? Wow. Ah, I couldn't drop in time. I think the Hydra should move up a bit. Lol, the sprinkler kill. Did you see that? Okay, got cornered by two sides. And they still can't hold it, what? Oh, I hate Clash. I hate Clash. And they got the lead, just press in.
press in, come on. Screw booyah bombs, they're so bad. Wow. Wow, what was that bomb? Bro, I swear Splat Zones is the single worst mode ever. I would rather play like Turf War. Splat Zone sucks. People don't understand this mode. It's too hard for people to comprehend. They see like, oh, there's a map and I I have a weapon I can paint and I could paint the map, but mm, what do I do? Ah, it's so tricky. I can't put this together. It's too, it's too complicated. There's the floor and there's like my weapon. All I can do is like paint the floor. What do I do? What's the point of this mode? I can't make it out. There's no way I have to paint the floor, right? No way. That's what people think, like they don't get it. They don't understand the most simple of things. <sighs> Uh, it's gonna be so painful to suffer through tw 10 of 20 of those ticket things. And we might actually drop in ranks, honestly. I can't see me win this alone. Like, I have to carry this alone. I can't flank on those maps, that's the shitty part. Ah, oh, we lost. We lost already. GG. We got only one guy with the with the hero shot that can do anything. Nah, we lost. What? Yeah, look at this. This is so over. <laughs> Lol, paint war. I actually didn't see the freaking bomb for some reason. It was right next to me in my camera. over so we're dropping ranks I can't play freaking splat zones with those guys go
Ah, they're everywhere. On their side, on our side, and nobody's doing anything because they cannot paint. How? How? What the hell? Come the hell on this side, come on. Come on, guys. Get to the other side. I almost got my hopes up here already. Ah, oh, don't lose the counter. Oh man. It's fine. Care for the other zone. Don't waste your time. Wow. Get the other zone! I told you this is over, but it was closer, way, way closer than I thought. But this is just impossible, how can you do this? It's an impossible matchup. And that just sucks. And you always get into stuff like that. Yeah, we're dropping. Ah, oh, we're dropping again. And we get the wrong effects. Oh man. I sh I should end the stream like this is it's not getting better here. Oh man. I just wish we would end on like a positive rank here that would be so great let me try next um, the next streak or this streak here let me try this if we drop I think I'm gonna end the stream so if we get below 270 negative then I think I will stop if we go over then maybe I give it one more shot to end the ticket and everything wow Why would she use ninja squid on a sniper? That's so weird to me. Wow. 
Wow. Okay, we should have this. Or not. I wanted to throw it down. Oh my god, miss input again. Oh my lord. I wish I would play like this. I wish I would play like this every time. Oh my god. And my team is just chilling. Why are you not pressing in? I made that huge opening and you wasted. Wow, I just hit that guy. Imagine your weapon doing what it's supposed to. Oh my god, imagine I, I survived that. Imagine I would have survived that. That would be like the god clip. Nothing hits, I don't get it. Is it what, because I'm jumping or something? how I like my hits to hit. Yes, yes, yes. Why does nobody paint? Why does nobody paint? Tell me. I don't understand. I don't understand. Why? What's the point in not painting? Tell me. Why would you do this? This makes no sense. Oh my fuck. Why? Bro, why? I've played like actual John Squid. Yes, thank God. Change the modes. God. Is it the new day now or is it the other the other way? Let me see. No, okay. The next rotation's new day. Oh, thank God, we're off of this awful mode. 
Okay, clam blitz. That can that can change a lot. Clam blitz is way more fun. But yeah, I tell you guys, if we fall below 270 later, I'm gonna quit this. We're not even playing out the tickets if we drop lower than that. If we get further up, then yeah, we do the rest of the tickets. But yeah, once this ticket is done, I'm done. Once I'm done with the string, I'm done with you. Basically. I've seen someone on Twitter, I think, that made uh, an actual booster pack of the table turf cards. Okay, the booyahs, there we go. What am I doing? What am I doing? Uh, that's the hard part when you have the... When you don't have your go-to gear set. You cannot really rely on the stuff that you usually can. And so my my whole play gameplay and everything is, is so weird. Like, I can't get used to this because it's not the actual stuff that I will have later, so it's pointless to get used to it. But if you play otherwise, if you play it in a different way, then, then it doesn't help you for the actual gear later. So, I don't know, it's just, it's just hard to not have your gear. Ah, that was dumb, but whatever. A can opener is a can opener. And they deceit right away, perfect. That's how I like it. If it's the other team they seeing, that's all fine to me. No! Why would you go so far? Why would you not stand close enough to the basket so that your team can dunk in? Yeah, that was super stupid. I don't know why I did it. Distraction, yeah, yeah, sure. That was exactly my plan, distraction. Okay, this should be it. I think that's it. Yeah, to to the clam. Exactly counted every clam. <coughs> ah, man, I'm really drained, honestly. Maybe that's why I'm playing so bad. Maybe my whole aim and everything is just not on point anymore. 
Which it never was, but even less so, I mean. to say at this point honestly I was gonna buy Splatoon 3 again because I like the game so much that I feel like it gave me so much already that I feel like I'm in debt like I need to pay more than what I already did for the game and I already bought the three pack of the amiibos and I also got the DLC obviously and the main game of course but that's only like all in all that's like two uh, it's it's one hundred and maybe twenty or thirty and I feel like that's that's still way, way too little money. I I need to pay this game more. I would like my actual estimation for the worth of this game for the software is about 500 ish. That's like my actual estimation. Not even joking. 500 would be okay. Would be like fitting for what you get. In terms of uh, intellectual value and everything. Ah, come on. So, therefore, I decided, okay. I just buy this game again and then I'm like somewhat more satisfied and I feel like I'm more uh, how do you say I'm more permitted to play this game Why do I go straight? This should have worked. This should have worked out. Yeah, lucky. No way. But what, what do you do? Jump out maybe? Or drop down to the other ground? I had no plan.
There is no way he can hit me with a freaking brush. And I cannot with my pencil. Imagine that. Out of bullets, I actually knew it. But sometimes it's like you weirdly miscalculate your moves, even though you're you know better. Kill him! Oh my god! Okay. Ah, that's so bad. Need another super clam, guys. We need another super clam, guys. Oh god, okay, we got two. Okay, that's it. Uh, that's just rough. Uh, I can't do nothing. Nothing. It's not in my hands at all. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Ghost T, hello, yeah, hi, welcome in. I'm just losing my mind here over rank mode, as always. It's like the standard thing in Splatoon, I guess. I just want to get so bad out of my freaking negative rank. I want to crawl out so bad. But it's impossible with those people. It's impossible. Impossible. You need to be super lucky to have teammates that are actually competent. And you have to have a good day. And no DCs. And the other team not being four Japanese guys knowing exactly what they do. Which is never the case, but still. They have at least one good player in the other team and that's enough to screw me. Ah, there's so much luck involved in this. I just don't know what to do. I can only like go on and try for more luck. I don't know what else you could do. <sighs> Yeah, and I'm exhausted, I'm tired, um, my aim is not so great. <laughs> my gear set is also not so great because I'm just currently trying to reroll my stuff. Yeah, nothing is really great here. Can we get this clam? Nah. Okay. 
Yeah, it's kind of dumb to jump back with seven clams. It's a bit stupid. Because if you have to defend with the clams, then yeah, you will just give clams to the other team. You chose Nessie. Yeah, I chose Nessie because first of all, like the alien team is really mainstream everyone will pick alien i guess they will have the most votes so i'm never a mainstream guy in the first place but also another thing is that i feel ah, i can't talk right now sorry another thing is that i feel that like it's it's about a myth here like you want to figure out which of the myths is real and to me aliens is not really a myth they are already real like there's no question about it really so i feel like team alien is kind of a fake team or it's not it doesn't really belong to that whole theme in my eyes and therefore I feel bad if I would support that there because it just I think it doesn't belong there and Bigfoot I never really heard of that too much and I have no connection to that thing so basically there's only Nessie left and also I like this the story of Nessie and the idea and all that so I can pretty much support that idea even without the Splatfest choice. I like the whole idea of Nessie. And yeah, therefore I chose Nessie. That's about the story of Nessie. So I'm not an alien defender, I'm a Nessie defender. Can guys, can you please freaking move up? Wow, nice plan. Going, going. Ah, oh, man. Ah, oh my god. Let's go! Oh my god. Obviously I didn't get the cooler effect. Making me regret choosing aliens. Yeah, it's just the thing... It's kind of a legit team in some way. But the thing is, you don't really have something to win if you choose aliens. Because all you get is like, imagine your team wins, imagine alien wins, and the Splatfest result basically claims that aliens are true. Then what do you win? You already know that they are true, so what did you win? Basically nothing, you can only defend what's already there. Whereas Team Nessie can actually make Nessie real, which I would say it's rather not so real at this point. But if they win Splatfest, they can make it real. Guys, get the freaking get the clam over! Oh my god! Ah! I can't believe this game. Fuck. I'm so frustrated already. I'm sorry, guys. I can't keep up my positivity on this. It's too much of a slap in the face. 
Yeah, I, I said I would quit if we go negative, which is the case right now, but let's just play out the ticket, whatever. Just get over, get this over with. Oh, man. Yeah, let's get this over with. We are fucking negative. Oh, shit. Minus 400 almost. Oh my god. Man, this is so rough. If you want to rank up, if actually your goal is to climb up in the ranks, you go insane. You actually lose your mind in this game, I tell you. Do never set your goal to be ranking up in this in this game's rank system. Do never try. This will this will make you lose your mind. That's my advice. Never ever care for your rank. I question if Clamblet's teammates are real people. Yeah, that's a good question. They might be just AI bots or something. They might just be NPCs here. That's like, that's an actual myth. You, you should put that on Splatfest as a team. Are teammates real? Because I don't believe it either. That's a very good team su suggestion. Wow, that was close. I need ink recovery, that's for sure. Okay, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. There we go. Let's go. Tacticula. Tacticula dunk right there. That's how you dunk with Tacticula. Oh god, that was bad. That was bad, but I got one in. Should've got all the three in, I was kinda... The approach was not so great. But yeah, we should have the lead still. How did that not hit? There is no way. They have the mind of an Octarian. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> that's so true. Such a good, good joke. Or it's not, it's not even funny, honestly. But yeah, it kind of is. And that's like a bunch of points for no reason. And nobody cares of my team, great. Throw your bombs, guys! Everyone has bombs, except me. Nobody uses them. Okay, let's go.
Oh, perfect side jump. That was beautiful. If only that was planned, I swear. I have no clams. Okay, I better retreat. I'm I have no clams, guys. I would. Dunk it in, dunk it in. Still ready. Oh my god. Yeah, that was too way too. Oh man. Way too slow. Okay, it's still you can't press in. Oh shit. Okay. Way too slow and we don't have any counter clam left. Uh we're set up for disaster here. Super clam. I must not die. More clams, more clams. Oh shit! I should have. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I should. I was. I was hesitant. Should I jump to my teammate and only get one clam in? And maybe die after or should I just go the long way and try to throw them myself somehow risking that I not get there I wasn't sure what's better but yeah they handled it even without me who would have believed honestly okay That's not what I want. So that was one win, okay, not too bad of a start. Maybe if we get 400 points, which is very optimistic, then we could even make it out of negatives in, in this streak. If we only get gold badges here in every match and we only win, no lose, no nothing, I can see 400 points be possible. Which would barely bring us over the negative, over the zero. But yeah. Let's not get our hopes up, I don't really believe. And how many tickets? I think we have like 12 or so left, maybe 11. Oh, and this map is hard. <clears throat> this map is really hard. Oh my god, lucky. That was that was not planned. What? How? How did I get that? Okay, nice one. I could have jumped out, but I wasn't sure. Not too sure if that was smart. Extend it, guys! Are you... Oh my god, really? Okay, nice job, nice job. Actual nice job. Oh my god, beautiful job. I can't get there in time. Nice. 
Ah, if only I made it down there. This should be it. This should be it though. This is over. Oh, it's not! Oh my god, I thought they had enough clams. I didn't even look at the clam count. Oh shit! See, that's a huge punishment we got there. But maybe we get another attack going. Come on, guys. No! I hate Kula, it's so damn slow. And it's really laggy, if you see that, I don't know. Maybe it doesn't come over in the stream, but it's hella laggy. This match is like... 10 FPS or something, it's really laggy. I wouldn't be surprised if someone DCs, honestly. This is so laggy. Not so good, guys. Come on, one hit. Ah, oh, that was so close. They almost extended. Holy crap. We don't even have a counter clam, oh, oh, that's not good. Not at all, come on. There we go. That was kind of just a distraction. No, I was, I was down. Actually, nice one. Get a power clam and finish them. Come on. No, throw bombs, throw bombs, throw bombs, throw your bomb. Oh, my lord, just throw your bomb. What's your issue? Throw bombs. Oh my god, don't do this to me. Oh, that was scary for no reason, man. Okay, we got one silver, not a gold, but it's okay. The streak is going at least. That's all that matters. Okay, three more. Can we do this? The team wasn't too bad. The team was actually not too bad.
but still they played a bit wacky especially towards the end but yeah should we wait until the next rotation and then see nah I don't know yeah, we can. Maybe it, it happens anyway. It's only one hour. Nah, I don't know. I will play out the ticket and see what the time is. I think 10 matches is 10 times 5 minutes is 50 minutes. Plus a bit more. It's like an hour anyway, so we will see. <clears throat> but yeah, when the ticket is done, I'm definitely done. Can't do more. special the signature jump with the cooler oh they have a lot of clams yeah, that might get dangerous So sick. No, I should have waited. Ah, I couldn't see what's going on. I was so fixed. I was so focused on the freaking on the super clan building. How do you know? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh god. Stop them. Okay. Okay, let's counter, let's counter. Come on, guys. Come on, what are you doing in the back? What? Why would you... We had two clams. We had two super clams. What are you doing? Oh, no. Oh no, guys! Don't blow this, please! Oh, please! Please, guys! 
please. Oh, man. Ah, guys, please, the streak. Oh, what do I do? I can only paint, basically. That's all I can do. Go, 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 go. Okay, that should, that should do it. There we go. No! No way, bro! Don't do this to me! Oh, oh my god, how did I do it? Oh, bro, that was lag only. That was lag exclusive. This would never be possible in a real match. Oh, man. You saw how the last clam was delayed, man. That was like a minute until it hit the basket. Oh god, that was rough. Number one tacticula user, I guess. That's pretty much what this was. Ground traveler score booster tacticula user. Bro, what was this match, man? That was insane. Okay, two more. Two more. <sighs> okay, Kermit and Oli Pop eighty eight. Uh, that's not so great. Kermit is great. He did something. But the other guy was kind of kind of a dead weight only. Uh, let's hope that there's some Japanese pro player dropping in, subbing for us. And yeah, should be 9 on the ticket. No, 10. What? That felt like 2 matches. <laughs> Okay, ten matches left then. Hmm. And I think Scorch Gorge is a bit more open. And we should have the range advantage, at least over the three others then that, that are not the Tri Stringer. I don't really know the range of Tri Stringer. But it's at least not a slouch. It's not that you should not underestimate it, that's all I know. Yeah, he's jumping out. Oh my god, I'm I should be jumping out. No, too slow. I was hesitant, damn. Oh, please, that's a dead weight guy. Oh, please don't. Bro, I shot. I shot around that, that splash wall. Okay, let's push. Oh, I can clamp so fast. Get the frick over here, guys! How many this ways do you need? Oh my lord! Get over there! What are you doing? What are you doing? 
Oh no way. Oh no way. No way. Now nah, that's it. Or is it? Try stringer? Oh my god, did we actually defend this? God, this guy. We have no super clam ready, nothing. That's ridiculous. Why do we not? Oh my god, guys. Nobody has anything ready. Oh my god, guys, come on. What? What is this? I should have chosen another lobby. This was this was a mistake. Actually, my bad for sticking with that lobby. Should have known better. Oh no! The last freaking thing on the on the floor, the last ink trail just hit like hindered me to go. Yeah, screw this match. Damn it. Ah oh, damn it, that was so stupid. How many openers do I have to do? I was actually, I was thinking of leaving the lobby, I should have. I should have left. Ah, oh, man, you have no idea of the fr frustration here. This is worse than anything. You will just, at some point, you will lose your mind. It's a fact. You cannot sustain your sanity in this mode. Or in this, in this, like, ranking here. If you have this idea in mind that you could ever get out of, like, lower ranks, don't. Just don't. Scrap that idea. That's not a thing. You can never escape low ranks. It's impossible. If you don't have a weapon that basically carries the entire match, it's over. You, there's no chance. It's literally impossible. Uh, yeah, okay, let's hope that we get some teammates. Something decent, come on. Okay, they got a they got a good Zilla batch at least. That's something. But it could be their lifetime achievement, so I don't know. Oh 
Oh god. Maybe I should have thrown cooler. I think I should have thrown cooler. It looked like an opportunity there. Nah, my aim is gone. I won't hit anything anymore. Come on. Go in, go, 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 go. There we go, two clams. Okay. It's a good start. This should have happened even before the first push. That's what I said, but I should have placed cooler there. There we go. Wait, what? Should have enough clams. I, I throwed him too. Okay, maybe the other guy, the from the other team, maybe they collected the clams. And then we had just seven. Okay, okay. Okay, nice one. Picked up on my guy. Ah, I clicked the wrong guy. Oh, that might cost me. Oh, the triple tap. No, couldn't reach. Ah, that was wacky. The, the rest of the team just didn't come. Okay, nice one. That's what? Oh, he almost had it. That was so close. Oh, that's dangerous. That's hella dangerous. Oh, that's insanely dangerous. Give me that flam. Oh shit, I need one more though. Okay, very good. There we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I missed the... But Kula's up. Yeah, that's it. Wait, 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 wait. Ah, you should... Does he... No, he's not waiting. Oh, they didn't have a clam. Didn't have a super clam ready before the basket closed. Okay, slightly lucky, but that's fine. That was about fine. At least they, they came in 
at a certain point. At least they attacked. Okay, one more. Oh no! Now we get one. Ah oh, man. Should I reroll this? Right away? Nah. Ah, that's. that's. that sucks. I can't even jump out of lobby. Anyway, okay, let's just finish the streak then and then see if we can uh, I, f I forgot what I want to say uh, yeah, finish the streak, then see what the, what the rank is, and then what else, then see we have enough money to reroll for the next chunks. If we don't have enough money... We might re-roll one of the two, maybe the shirt. And then try for one more effect. Like to, to get one more um, of our preferred effects, I mean. Uh, what am I doing? Okay, that's fine. Oh yes! Oh my god, that was dirty! Not even one clam! Why would you attack? Why would you even attack with zero clams? There's no way. Attack, guys. Oh my god. Get him! Nice. No, not so nice. They delayed. They delayed us. Ah, this works out for them. Yeah, I better go on my own, I don't trust my team. Ah, why do I jump all the time? Oh my god, nice one. Can we not get countered here? That's the question. Is this gonna be a sweep or do we actually throw this? Oh my god. No way there's... He was not dead? Okay, it's too late, it's too late, that's too late. It's fine. Okay, let's go. Ah! Ah, can you? Nah. 
Why are you defending with a roller and then also failing? What is even your point? Like, defending fine, but then do it! Do it! Defend! Oh my god, guys! Guys, use your special! Ah, this is... Oh my god, this is so cringe. Get him! I swear, oh my lord. I am losing my mind. Jump! Jump! Oh god, jump. Oh lord. This is it. This is it. Oh man, why? Why would you throw away a game like we had a 20 hundred lead 80 points of lead how can you even throw this away how how and we had a roller a roller and i don't even know what the other thing was how tell me how dc doesn't matter man i Fuck this, man. Bro, how the hell? He look at this. The roller guy. That that was the one who deceived. How? I saw him on the map. He did not deceive. That's fake. I saw him. We, we have two guys with... Uh... Killer whale. How the hell can you not defend with that? <sighs> okay, one more win. Come on. We lost the actual win streak, like the yeah, the uninterrupted win streak. We we failed already. But we can still finish the, the streak at least. Oh man. It's just ridiculous what they managed to lose. They... T it should be impossible to lose. They still somehow get it. Okay. Got a Dooley's, got a Gallon, got a Roller. And that's the strong roller, that's the one hit roller. I'm dead. You don't wanna... You don't wanna deal with a sploosh. It's unwinnable. Okay, we, we got the whole map. Come on, do something with it. Do something with it, guys. That's so unfair, I hate Inkvec. Inkvec is so unfair. Defend this, I swear, if you don't... Bro... How can you not?
LOL Oh my god, I did not make that jump What is this? Oh, come on Just rush in, they got cooler we got two super clams and they still managed to not freaking get anything going. Get the fuck in there. I can't take this. Do your goddamn jobs. <sighs> How can you not rage at this game? And they gotta dunk it in. Okay, it's fine. It's not. It's not fine. It's not fine at all. Please. Oh, God. Attack. Right now. Come on. You're gonna die. What is this? I swear, if you lose that fight. Okay. God, my aim is. My aim just doesn't exist. Oh, guys, please. Guys, I swear. Yeah, that was not too bad, honestly. That was not too bad. Oh my god, yes. Ah, come on. That was sick. One more clam, guys. Do your goddamn jobs. Still not over. Still not over. Don't celebrate too early. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, what a struggle for nothing. Oh, man, this is nerve wracking, I tell you. You have to put so much effort for nothing. If they if they would just play along, then it would be so easy, so smooth and not like relaxing even. It would be not exhausting at all. Oh my god, guys, do you see this? We actually made it. We actually made it into positive. Somehow we are on plus nine. <laughs> oh my god, single digit positive. And we have 40k points, uh, money I mean. Holy hell. Okay, so we can actually we can scrub both of the clothes and then we can yo sick music ok 
Yeah, that's a sick remix. I never heard that remix. I think it's new. Also, what the hell? Wait a second. The tower is red? Is that because of the Splatfest? I guess. That's team green, that's team purple, and that's team red. That's Bigfoot here. The big tower is team three. Wow. That's sick. Okay, but anyway, let me do the reroll. Oh my god, I'm still <laughs> still shaking from that match. Okay, so this is going. And this is going. And then we make use of the six remaining effects. Uh, ticket, ticket things, you know, you know what I mean. And then it should actually be day flip even, and then we can also use all the, the conch shells that we earned. All at once and then finish off like that, I think that's the, it's the best ending. By the way, we're negative again <laughs> for paying here, but we had a glimpse of positivity. That's something. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, six more matches. Should be six times five minutes, thirty minutes. Yeah, thirty minutes. Should be almost the next rotation. Maybe we see it. If so, then I will also do the reroll for the the daily, the daily reroll on the slot machine. But yeah, let's see. I kind of have a headache now, to be honest with you. I need to sleep, <laughs> I think. Okay. Six more nerve-wracking matches. That's not a match. Oh man. I swear online is horrible. In the current state, I think they want to patch something. But in the current state, man. That's unreasonably painful. I don't even know when I can change my name again. I think it was the 15th. So it's two more, three more weeks almost before I can change my name back to the normal. But yeah. I might even use uh, my my YouTube handle as my name now 
I want to see if I get a different number on my splash tag. Because I was kind of disappointed by my number that I had there. So I might try that out. Maybe I get a better number. But yeah, I'm tired now. This has to end at some point. I think the snapping isn't needed. It's maybe what I'm doing wrong. I'm always trying to go for some crazy snapshot stuff. But that's either super expert level, nah, whatever. Or it's not needed. Okay, let's go extend that. Nah, he's dead. Ah, I was gonna throw it. It would have just worked out. But it should be a good position where it lies. There we go. That's the one he picked up. I don't know, man. Okay, good job. One more. I couldn't get it. Are oh, they going for counter already? Oh, barely. Yeah, nice body block, mate. So many clams. We should get something going here. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that's so bad. That's the literal worst case. <sighs> we wasted all three super clams for no reason. Yeah, one survived. That was mine, actually. Okay, two in. Or maybe only one, I'm not sure if that hit. <clears throat> okay, there we go. Push in. Push in. Why do they need wipeouts to do this? Just go in. This is complete overkill. Oh my god, I thought the basket was open already. I'm maybe too tired, I think. That could be it. Oh, 
Oh no. Go, go, go. I should do the, the KO trick. Okay, whatever. That's fine. The lonely agent. Hello. Hi, welcome in. What is up? Did you... F nah, you didn't play with me, do you? That would be crazy. Nah, why would you go on YouTube to... To look up random people? I don't know. You're not from the game, I think. But yeah, hi, welcome in. No! Why is it never? Why is it never the one I need? Damn. Playing ranked, I see. Yeah, I, I'm struggling just to get out of the negative points. But we should be out by now. Like, if we don't drop this series here, we should be out. And then the next series should start in, in a positive number. And then from there I can maybe work my way up to, to a thousand points. And then try to rank up to X rank finally. Mind if I join? Ah, it's, the thing is... Ah, I don't know, we could... I could, yeah, like... I was gonna end the stream when my ticket runs out, which is in six matches or five now. So I don't know if you mind playing five matches with me only. But we can do that, sure. After that match, obviously. I couldn't leave the lobby in time. I didn't see your text in time to like quit out the lobby. So, sorry, but you can already put the, ah, you could already put the, the pool name in your, like join the pool continental, it's, it should be somewhere in chat, or maybe not anymore, I don't know what you see. But the, the code is continental, like the continent and the, the verb of it, continental, and that's a reference to the hotel in, in John Wick. And as you can see, my, my squid's in-game name is John Squid now, which is obviously also a reference to John Wick. So here you can see it on the map, you see my name, John Squid. I had to do that for the 400 sub special last weekend. Ah, that was so dumb. Yeah, now I'm stuck with that name and so I, I try to make the most out of it and then... I thought, yeah, we can just keep using that kind of joke as long as I'm stuck with this name. Oh, I almost screwed up the attack there. Oh no, I came too late. What? How how in hell's name did I survive this? Was it the cooler cooler defense? I guess it was cooler wall, yeah. That was crazy. Oh, 
how? How? Oh, please don't lose me the serious. Please. This is ridiculous. How is my aim that bad? How can anything in this freaking universe be this bad? I missed? Wow. Wow. <laughs> Imagine missing that. God, give me clams, give me something. Go in, go in, go in. Go in, guys. Come on. It can't be so hard. Come on. Yeah, I forget. You can't join Sirius. Yeah, I, you can. I can make a lobby for open, but it just doesn't give me any rank points, really. But we can do that if you want. For like five-ish matches or so, because I gotta kind of sleep at some point. And I was going to end stream after the ticket runs out here. Which is in five matches. Wow! 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 How? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I'm losing my mind! Oh my god! How? 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 <sighs> if you have any weapon with a grenade, anything, a splash wall, a grenade, toxic mist even, something, and they have, how in God's name do you even lose? How? How do you not stop an attack? How the fuck? God, fuck. This is ridiculous. So yeah, I told you the code continental. And if you want to join, then join. If not, then not. But yeah, my, my ticket is running out at like four, four, four matches, but we can do like five or even six or something like that. But after that, I need to like end this. I, I an agent. Okay. I guess that's you. Oh wow, great. Great, great, great. Oh man, I swear the online... The online experience in this game is really painful in all aspects. As so as I join, yeah, you can join too. Sure. Everyone can join for like four ish matches or five. If that's what you want, it's not much, but I gotta end this at some point. 
Or we can say we can end when the rotation ends. We can do it like that, which is kind of the same anyway, but yeah. Hmm. All right, we got one guy. What does Junior even custom Junior have as a bomb? I think that's like I think that's torpedo. So nobody else joining? Is that it? If so, then I guess, okay, that's not it, so I barely made it in, just before I hit the start. It's so stupid, but it's so funny. Making it's gonna be half an hour just in the lobby alone. Finally, oh god. Okay, guys, show what you can do. Carry me, regain some of my sanity. It's really needed to end this. I need some brain cells back from you. So to to end the stream on a high note and not like in depression. Okay. AR exactly. Exalt Nah, Kato's dumb. Just see that that was the absolute failure. Squid leap is my what? It's my favorite boss. Ah, you mean the? Yeah, that was nice. Squid leaping. Oh, 
I couldn't get it on. We gotta press in from the from the other side. Okay, cooler is done. Cooler is down for you. But I placed it way too much in front. Ah, that was that was a cruel death. How does does the blubber always hit me? It doesn't matter, like the, somehow even if you dodge the the bubbles, they somehow still hit you. I don't know how that's the thing. But I guess like What is this? I hit him like five times. How? That's insane, how? It's, uh, wow. I don't know how to deal with this map. Really? Oh my god. No. 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 Lol. Oh my god. How? How did we win this? That was impossible. We lost this so hard, we somehow got it back. Yeah, that was booyah. That was definitely booyah. 13 kills, how? How did I do that? I never hit anything. But the the tacticula kills don't count, do they? Nah. I painted the most. <laughs> Lord. Imagine the sniper in the team painting the most. Lol, that's so dumb.
I think there should be like a rule set or something. The, there should be like the middle squid has to jump and then like, I don't know. You gotta invent some rules for the squid leaping. Okay, so we somehow won last match. Let's see about this. If that was just a... Just a one-off. Nah, I'm too scared to jump there. I'm hitting nothing. It's actually crazy. Nothing! Even when it's like right in my face, I'm just not hitting. Why do I even try, honestly? I should just avoid any contact. I'm not getting... Not getting any kills. Yeah, why do I try? <sighs> and nice to see you guys. And nice loss. Great. That's how I like my matches. Lose and defeat and deceit. So who deceit? Was it the other guy or one of you? Or even me. <laughs> okay, attempt to make the rules for Squid Leap. Alright. I'm gonna... Ah, shit. I could've... Ah, uh, sorry guys. I did... I quit the lobby because I thought it was someone of you... Um, who deceived, so I didn't want to go on without you. That's why I refresh the lobby. I don't know if you can even get out anymore. I guess you're stuck in your matches now. Ah, the online mode is so rough. Yeah, I screwed up. I should have gambled and press OK. Yeah, at least you got it. There we go, okay. Nice, you could escape your dead lobby. <laughs> the, see if if the if the last squid always has to jump over all the other squids, imagine when there are four squids, they can't even make the leap over over two. So maybe if the second, I don't know, maybe the, the second last or the middle squid or something, if they jump, then like if, if I jump now, I don't know, but then the distance gets further away and then it doesn't work anymore so that's also not really a thing but I don't know what to do like there must be some rules to this someone has to invent squid leap rules ok 
Okay, I double booyah. That's kind of a kind of bad matter. Bad, bad. How do you say? Matters. Manners. Bad manners. That's what I mean. No way! <sighs> it's also, I think it's, it's, it's the map. It's the map. I need to... I need to get better at positioning on the maps. Cause... The, the charge just played different than all my other weapons. And I'm still used to whatever I'm used to. I don't know. I'm used to losing, I guess. Oh my god. Grenades, guys. Grenades. Throw your subs. Throw your subs on the tower, please. Ah, oh, you got the other one. How? Oh my god, how? I don't understand this game, I'm sorry. I have no idea how this works. I don't get this game, screw it. This makes no sense. I'm too tired, my aim is off and I don't know, there's lag everywhere. Can't focus up. I'm frustrated. Everything comes together. My gear set sucks. Maybe my sensitivity sucks. That's literally everything that holds me back at this point. I'm tired, I'm hungry, everything. Every excuse you can come up with is is valid here. If only like the <laughs> that that makes no sense. But if only the middle squid jumps, then the last squid never makes it anywhere, so I don't even know. What could you do with this? Because the back squid we can't make it the back squid because you could even have lobbies with eight players or even ten players, I think. You cannot make the last squid jump over everyone. It's just impossible. Even when there are four squids, you cannot make the jump over all the three others. So there must be some other rule. Do you just like... I don't know. How do you get the last squid to follow the others somehow? Oh my god, I wanted to super jump, but then I like pulled my special. Ugh. Ooh. 
Wow, I hit something. After like a hundred shots. He's still alive? Also, my controller is acting up, it just feels like. They they buffed Ink Strike to to way too OP. It's way too strong right now. I just like touch the outmost thing of it and I die. I should only get damaged or something, but no, they straight up kill me. But this I survived for some reason. It's so laggy, oh my god. I should never win that. I just can't hit anything. Ever. Nah. Nah, I'm basically done. I can't, I can't play anymore. I cannot hit anything. I don't know how frustrating how frustrating this is when you hit zero shots. Absolute zero. Okay, one. It's the first hit in the game. Push the tower. I didn't even pay attention to the lead. Push the tower. Ah, uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. I wish I could ever see the windscreen of this game, but I guess that doesn't even exist. They didn't program this to ever make you win. It's just a losing game altogether. Okay, should be rotation anyway, so I told you guys I'm done here. I can't take no more of this, it's just too much. And I need to get up tomorrow, so I have to sleep. Yeah, sorry. This has to end here. Seven hours, yeah, that should be... Should be enough, guys. Ah, okay, one. We got one. One roll there. The suffering comes to a close, yeah. I have to end this here. And my ticket is done anyway, so... It's exactly where I wanted to...
to end up basically and also it's the the new day which means we can do the cash roll here we just have enough cash so let's do that and let's see what all what what we get from the nine nine shells so first thing is a banner okay what else oh wow a food ticket give me something I never had any gold capsules or anything I just had trash that's how lucky I am wow what do I do with like a a small XP ticket what do I do with that okay abilities that's fine Come on, give me something. Nah, yeah, that is something, okay. Come on. What the hell? Stickers, okay. Okay, chunks, always good. And... Wave riding incline model. Okay. <laughs> That's the quote of the day, I guess. Yeah, alright. So, that is that. Catalog level 6. Oh, yeah, new. There's new stuff in the stores. Let me check that real quick. And yeah, then we end this in the plaza. Actually, no, I can't end in plaza because I want the sound. I want to play some sound to end it. So we we head back to the lobby. Okay, this might be. It's too expensive, lol. How do they look? Maybe I use those even. But I want to change the main effect. Damn, okay, nah, forget about it. Okay, what's here? Nothing. And here also nothing. Good, okay. Back to the lobby. And yeah, we will end this here. Anything else I forgot? We can like maybe check here. The banner. Nah, that looks bad. Wave riding something model. Incline model. So here the quote of the day. Wave riding incline model. Alright guys, yeah that was it. That was very, very painful towards the end. The start was kind of fine-ish. What is this sound? Why is it so techno in here? Actually, this is my favorite lobby song. The one that's playing already. It's so like weird, weirdly trancy and chill and everything. I love this. Um. Did they even add the new Splatfest song? Not yet, I see. 
it might be DLC only even. The new City of Color version that should only play in the DLC from what I what I can figure. So yeah, what song? Any song wishes? How do we end this? Maybe Anarchy Rainbow. Yeah, let's go Anarchy Rainbow. That's about fun. Actually, no. Let's go City of Colors, the old version. Let's go. Last time that we hear the old version before the next one comes up. So, enjoy this and have a good night or day or whatever it is. And yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time. Hopefully I can stream the Splatfest, but if not, then yeah, then not. But at least we got some shells for Team Nessie now. And yeah, I didn't get many chunks and stuff for the rest, but it's fine. Anyway, yeah, good night. Good. Yeah, sleep well and see you next time. Bye.